attention stations on the network. Our broadcast will begin in five minutes from my mark. In five, four, three, two, one, mark. That was your five-minute time check, stations. Attention stations on the network. Our broadcast will begin in two minutes from my mark. In five, four, three, two, one, mark. That was your two minute time check, stations. Attention stations on the network. Our broadcast will begin in one minute from my mark. In five, four, three, two, one, mark. That was your one minute time check, stations.
on the Hawkeye Sports Network from Learfield. Hawkeye basketball is on the air. Oh! Hawkeye basketball is brought to you by Authentic Brand, unique Hawkeye apparel at Authentic-Brand.com. hy V score big savings with a new hy V Perks membership. Honda, to see how Honda crushes the competition, see your central Midwest Honda dealer. Honda gets the Midwest. Riverside Casino and Golf Resort, home of the Draft Day Sports Lounge, just minutes south of Iowa City. United Healthcare, committed to helping people live healthier lives. U.S. Cellular, built for the Hawkeyes, built for silencing notifications and turning up the noise. U.S. Cellular, built for us. Wimmer's Meats, the official hot dog of the Hawkeyes. University of Iowa Healthcare, changing medicine, changing lives. And by Alliant Energy, powering a clean energy future. Welcome to the Iowa Soybean Association pregame show. Delivering opportunities and results for Iowa's 40,000 soybean farmers. After a couple games against Big Ten type competition in San Diego uh, over Thanksgiving, Iowa basketball is back home in the friendly, familiar orbit of Carver Hawkeye Arena and Mediacom Court with more questions answered and certainly some remaining, which makes tonight's matchup with North Florida all the more essential. It's 4-2 and two Iowa hosting 4-3 and three North Florida. The Ospreys, who call the Atlantic Sun Conference home. How you doing, everybody? This is Gary Dolphin. Bobby Hansen is alongside, as usual. Our engineer producer is Corey Sheets. Welcome to the Iowa Soybean Producers Association pregame show. Bobby, uh, you watched the Hawkeyes lose to Oklahoma 79-67. You know, really tough a shooting game, but then a terrific witnessing of a solid bounce-back victory the next day over Big East. Seton Hall, 85-72. Iowa went from 36% to 56% shooting uh, in victory. What did you see? What did you learn? What did you like? Yeah, you know, what I saw was was when you don't make shots, you don't look very good, Gary. And that, that first game against Oklahoma, the, the defensive pressure that the Sooners put on the Hawkeyes, they just couldn't get anything to drop, especially in the first half. And then they made three at the end of the game, so uh, that kind of carried over for they processed the game plan on Thanksgiving night to play Seton Hall, who was going to bring that same type of toughness at you on the defensive end, and the Hawks responded great. Um, the young kids looked good. Owen Freeman, Brock Harding, Josh Dix, uh, Bryce Sanford, uh, you know, all those guys got in there and did something uh, on, on a positive note, so good to see them bounce back on a quick turnaround against Seton Hall, and showed me that they can rebound as well when they follow a, a game plan. Oklahoma is a great offensive rebound team. The Hawks were able to out-rebound them in that game because they really had to concentrate keep them off the board. Same way with Seton Hall with their uh, big guy, Betty Ako. Uh, he had some rebounds, but he wasn't a major factor in that game. Bobby, the Hawkeyes have four starters averaging in double figures, led by Ben Cricky, Peyton Sanford. The fifth guy, DeSante Bowen, scores seven points and is dishing out three and a half assists. I mean, that's a solid balance sheet, isn't it? Yeah, DeSante Bowen, he he leads the nation. I think definitely the Big Ten in assist-to-turnover ratio. That's five assists for every one turnover that he has. So um, he's coming into his own. He had a really good game against Alabama State uh, a couple of weeks ago. Uh, Showed us what he can do. He's quick, but this is a 10-man rotation. Fran's going to be able to mix and match in there, put some different combos out there for uh, depending on what the matchups are. Laji Dembele, another one that I forgot to mention. He had a good showing out there in San Diego. That's a tough kid. He can really hit the boards and 50-50 balls out there. Laje is going to get down there and and uh, scrap it out. Laji Dembele is playing uh, so so much unlike a first-year yeah. player. He's mature beyond his years, and that, that can only benefit the Hawks going forward. The Hawkeyes are tops in the Big Ten. Averaging nearly 89 points a game. That's 17th nationally. Uh, Competition starts to escalate, though, uh, this evening. North Florida lost to LSU 75-63 last week. Great comeback from uh, from a deep hole, and they got back to within striking distance but lose it by a dozen. They have a young man named Chaz Lanier, who's a, a hot shooting guard. No relation to the NBA Hall of Famer Bob Lanier, by the way, but he he leads the Ospreys with a 16.5 rebound average 
Lanier's made 22 threes, and he's shooting 45%, 89% from the foul line. Half half of North Florida's field goal attempts are from three. That's uh, number one key as we get to those later on in the broadcast. If, if you're not paying attention there, they're going to come up and uh, and sting you a little bit. But uh, just watching them warm up here, Gary, they're in blue, navy blue, and, and gray uniforms here. These guys don't work on anything in the paint. All the guys out there shooting are from three-point land. And you know what? They're making a good majority of them right now without defense on them. So Hawks got to be there on catch, run them off that line. Averaging 10 and a half made threes. They had 11 last week against the LSU Tigers. Uh, that's pretty good. Matt Driscoll, uh, an engaging personality. He's in his 15th year as head coach. Peyton Sanford scored a season-high 22 points, grabbed nine rebounds for the Hawkeyes in the win over Seton Hall. And steady Eddie, steady Big Ben Cricky, notch 19 uh, on an 8-for-10 shooting night. So the Hawkeyes are getting it done in the offensive end. It's the third meeting all-time between Iowa and North Florida. We'll tip off a little bit after 8 o'clock. Our pregame show continues its coverage in a minute, sponsored by the Iowa Soybean Association dealers, uh, uh, producers of, uh, of Iowa. As a proud sponsor of the Iowa Hawkeyes, U.S. Cellular wants you to make the most of today by choosing game day traditions first and scrolling later. U.S. Cellular built for us. Up next, we take a trip down memory lane with the Hawkeye historical winning moment presented by Riverside Casino and Golf Resort. This is Hawkeye Basketball from Learfield. To anyone passing through our state, fields and fields of corn might be what they see. But the people who call Iowa home know it's so much more. Corn is ethanol, a homegrown, renewable fuel. Corn is delicious pork, beef, poultry, and dairy. Corn is in 4,000 products we rely on every day. So yeah, our highway views are full of corn, and we're proud of it. Because corn grows Iowa. Show your support for Iowa corn farmers at iowacorn.org backslash corn grows Iowa. With the Hawkeyes, every pass, shot, layup, and score is more than just part of the game. It's a testament to the teamwork, elbow grease, and can-do attitude it takes to win. In the same way, Case IH knows every successful farm is more than just a farm. It's the product of top-notch tillage, planting, harvesting, hay, and forage equipment at the hands of hardworking growers. Get a slam dunk by visiting your local Case IH dealer or go to caseih.com slash Hawkeyes to learn more. Go Hawks! Right now, you are not in the crowded Carver Hawkeye Arena, but you could be. You're not cheering a Hawkeye steal, fast break, and slam dunk, but you could be. Play the Hawkeye Gold Scratch Ticket, and you could win a VIP game day experience to see the Iowa men's basketball team. The countdown to Carver promotion from the Iowa Lottery lets you be a part of the action. To enter your ticket and see details, visit ialottery.com slash VIP. The big game, family, friends. We know you count on Alliant Energy to deliver the safe, reliable energy you need. Whether you're watching the game, cooking your famous burgers, or leaving a light on for loved ones. For us, it means going beyond the expected to make sure we're planning for the energy you need today and tomorrow. That way you can keep your eye on the ball and focus on what's most important to you. Find out more at AlliantEnergy.com slash Powering Beyond. I'm Ingrid Lizarraga, breast surgeon at the University of Iowa Holden Comprehensive Cancer Center, the state's only NCI-designated cancer center. Here, we look beyond just the type of cancer you have to discover the molecular details of the disease. We have teams dedicated to each cancer type, with treatments and trials you won't find anywhere else in Iowa. Go to uihc.org cancer. The big game, family, friends. We know you count on Alliant Energy to deliver the safe, reliable energy you need. Whether you're watching the game, cooking your famous burgers, or leaving a light on for loved ones. For us, it means going beyond the expected to make sure we're planning for the energy you need today and tomorrow. That way you can keep your eye on the ball and focus on what's most important to you. Find out more at AlliantEnergy.com slash Powering Beyond. Welcome back to the Iowa Soybean Association pregame show. Biodiesel, moving Iowa forward. Oh, what a great time of the year. It's the holidays, yes, but what a great time to be a Hawkeye fan with all that's going on. 
football. Uh, wrestling uh, won its 19th in a row over Iowa State Sunday. Uh, college basketball, Caitlin Clark and the Hawkeye women won the Fort Myers tournament. The Hawks split two tough games out in San Diego. It's a great time to be a Hawk, and it's a great time to uh, give you our Hawkeye historical winning moment, courtesy of our friends at Riverside Casino and Golf Resort. We'll talk a little Hawkeye hoops here. Stop by today for a relaxing massage at the spa at Riverside Casino and Golf. Fine dining at Ruthie's Steak and Seafood. Always fine dining at Ruthie's. And so much more. Visit Riverside Casino and Golf Resort today, located minutes south of Iowa City, right down 218. It's almost four years ago to the day, November 21 of 2019, when North Florida was here last, and the Hawkeyes uh, defeated the Ospreys. Uh, by a count of 83-68. And, Bobby, what I remember about that game is the dominance on the glass. Iowa out-rebounded North Florida 48-35 with 20 on the offensive glass. More of the same, please. Yeah, he had great effort to reach some of them names down at Jack Nungy. We had Luca Garza gave 28 and 12 rebounds, a double-double for Big Luca there, uh, Joe Wieskamp and Connor McCaffrey there, your starters. So Jordan Bohannon in there making shots. But, uh, yeah, this team is going to come in and battle you, and, and uh, that's what they do. They go out and on the road. They get these guarantee games here. They get paid, and uh, they're going to give you a tough test here. So, yeah, that one didn't seem that long ago in 2020. Joe Wieskamp had 14 points, 11 for Jack Nungy, and seven rebounds. Cordell Pemsel came off the bench, grabbed seven nice. rebounds, and started his career. A lot of youngsters then named Connor McCaffrey and Joe Wieskamp. I remember C.J. Frederick was on that team. And, of course, the great Luca Garza played 28 minutes that night and put up 29 and 12. He was scratching the surface, a surface of what he would become. The Hawks hit 32 of 72 shots. North Florida, take note, they hit 12 threes in 29 attempts. So they haven't changed much, uh, if at all, under Matt Driscoll. They're, they're going to get after you with those long-range bombs. Here's a stat. They've got like 816 straight games that they have made a three-point field goal. Can you believe that? It's almost a century's worth it. Yeah, I think it's when, from when they started. Uh, every time they've been in the D1 <laughs> level, they've made a three-point field goal. Back in the peach basket days. That's our Hawkeye historical winning moment as Iowa defeated North Florida four years ago by a count of 83 to 68. Happy holidays from the Keel family and everybody at Riverside Casino and Golf. Up next, we'll look at the Iowa City Sports Commission women's update and the U.S. Bank scoreboard. This is Hawkeye Basketball from Lurfield. Right now, you are not in the crowded Carver Hawkeye Arena, but you could be. You're not cheering a Hawkeye steal, fast break, and slam dunk, but you could be. Play the Hawkeye Gold Scratch Ticket, and you could win a VIP game day experience to see the Iowa men's basketball team. The countdown to Carver promotion from the Iowa Lottery lets you be a part of the action. To enter your ticket and see details, visit IALottery.com slash VIP. Woohoo! Everyone knows the BBB is the Better Business Bureau, but depending on what you need, it's the Better Plumber Bureau, the Better Auto Mechanic Bureau, the Better Accountant Bureau. That's because the BBB connects people with businesses they can trust. So think of the BBB as the Better Check That Business Out First so you don't get ripped off Bureau. Be smart. Always look for the BBB seal because it's looking out for you. Find a better business anytime at BBB.org. Draft Day Sports Lounge is the ultimate place to watch the game, have some fun, and show off your golfing skills with Top Golf Swing Suite. Top Golf Swing Suite in Draft Day delivers a one of a kind simulation that's fun for golfers and non golfers alike. Pair that with Draft Day's live sports viewing, local craft beers, and delicious menu, and you have a winning pair. Riverside Casino and Golf Resort, home of the Draft Day Sports Lounge and Top Golf Swing Suite, just minutes south of Iowa City. Whether you're building a backyard fence for your family's new best friend or firing up the excavator for your next commercial project, a free and simple call can save you from expensive fines and even save your life. Call 811 at least two days before you start your next project to have underground utility lines located and marked. At MidAmerican Energy, your safety is our number one priority. So make it your priority to call 811 before you dig. Paid for by the customers of MidAmerican Energy. 
fans, be sure to visit and connect with these local business partners of the Iowa Hawkeyes, located in the Des Moines area. Car Law, Community Choice Credit Union, and Royal Flooring. Are your car payments baking you crazy? Bring home the bacon when you move your car loan to Community Choice and get up to three months of no car payments. Your bacon called. It's ready to go home. Bring home the bacon at unbankyourbacon.com. Loan subject to credit approval and analysis. See Credit Union for details. If you're looking for the perfect place to host your holiday party, look no further. Come to Bumps at Finkbine. Have a good time as our new chef, Rick McCombs, provides an unforgettable experience. Don't forget about Thirsty Thursday Super Social Hour, where Bumps offers buy one, get one free on domestic beer bottles, house wine, well cocktails, and appetizers. Not only is Bumps the ideal spot for Hawkeye pregaming, they also offer a fantastic Sunday brunch. Bumps is your one-stop spot for great food and a great time. Go to Finkbine.com for more information. Welcome back to the pregame coverage, courtesy of the Iowa Soybean Association, Iowa and North Florida. This is a very important game because Hawks are off uh, for the next three, four days. Well, they're not off. They'll be in the gym here at Carver uh, on Mediacom Court working their tails off because next week, Monday, Thursday, Sunday, in this order, at Purdue, number one ranked Purdue, at Iowa State on Thursday, at home for Michigan on Sunday. Uh, I'll have Bobby comment on that in just a little bit. Right now, the Iowa City Area Sports Commission brings you the Hawkeye Women's Sports Update. The uh, Iowa City Area Sports Commission is responsible for our community being home to countless amateur sporting events and state tournaments, volleyball, wrestling, tennis, and much more. The Sports Commission generates significant annual economic impact while adding substantially to our quality of life. The Iowa City Area Sports Commission, a proud presenting sponsor of UI Women's Athletics. Learn more at wegotnext.org. The Hawkeye women's basketball team with its uh, National Player of the Year candidate, Caitlin Clark. Today was announced Caitlin earned Big Ten Player of the Week honors. It's the 20th weekly award from the Big Ten for Caitlin Clark. That's second most in conference history. She garnered weekly honors six times last season, and now for the second time this year. Clark led Iowa to three victories in three days at the Gulf Coast Showcase a Classic over Purdue-Fort Wayne, Florida Gulf Coast, and number 14, Kansas State. This week, uh, this past week, uh, Caitlin averaged 27 points, seven assists, five rebounds, and two steals. That's just amazing. Yeah, keep it up, and uh, great job by uh, the uh, women uh, Hawkeye basketball there. I mean, it's not just Caitlin Clark. They got a great basketball team, and everybody's chipping in and doing something on the positive side. Lisa Bluter gets uh, wins number 500, 501, and 502. Yeah. Way to go, Lisa. Uh, soccer, two members of the Hawkeye women's soccer team, which made the uh, round of 32 in the postseason. Uh, the uh, women's soccer team, uh, or the uh, all-North region was announced, the all-North region team. Fifth-year senior Samantha Carey and senior Macy Enneking, that outstanding goalie, are just the third and fourth Hawkeyes ever to earn first-team regional honors, joining Chloe LaCase Le- and Melanie Pickert back in 2014. By the way, the Hawkeye women's basketball team will return home to host Bowling Green this Saturday afternoon. Tip time is set for 12.30 inside sold-out Carver Hawkeye Arena. That's the uh, women's Hawkeye women's sports update courtesy of the Iowa City Area Sports Commission. Now a U.S. Bank scoreboard. At U.S. Bank, we know when you invest in a community, the community invests in you. We're committed to providing high-quality, innovative products and services that meet the needs and demands of our customers. U.S. Bank, equal housing lender, member FDIC. A couple games of interest going on. A light schedule for a Wednesday night. 18th-ranked Villanova trails at home to St. Joe's. 62-51, seven minutes to go in Philly. Number 22, James Madison has a 13-point lead on Buffalo midway through the second half. At halftime... 17th-ranked North Carolina, 61, number 10, Tennessee, 39. Wow. <laughs> How about that? Carolina. Carolina blue is making Tennessee blue. 61, 61 39. At half. Yeah, at half. Well, you know, Carolina, you has got another score. terrific team. Also at the half, uh, Tony Bennett and Virginia lead 14th-ranked Texas A&M, 27-26. Later, it's Colorado at Colorado State, 20th-ranked Colorado State. Number seven, Duke, is at Arkansas this evening. 
Uh, game in the Big Ten, one game there. Ohio State leads Central Michigan 50 to 31. Five minutes deep in the second half. That is the U.S. Bank scoreboard. Should tell you that uh, the Hawks will be at uh, the Hawks will be at Purdue coming up on Monday. Purdue climbed to the top of both the Associated Press and USA Today coaches poll. This is the third consecutive season the Boilermakers have been ranked number one. Bobby, it marks the first time in Big Ten history that a team has been ranked number one in three consecutive years. And now Purdue's been ranked number one for nine weeks over the last three seasons. Yeah, they're they're, they're solid basketball team. They got those two freshman guards from last year. They're now sophomores at uh, Braden Smith, really playing well. And they got big Zach Eady, obviously. He's a mountain inside there. And, uh, you know, they marched through Maui there. They beat three terrific basketball teams, all ranked in the top 20, I believe. And uh, impressive. They got guys playing their roles, coming in off the bench. They're going to be scrappy. They hustle. And uh, they rebound. And they, they really play well together. Uh, he- he was named MVP at that Maui Invitational after averaging 25 points, 13 rebounds, and two block shots. He'll be a tough guard for the Hawkeyes on Monday night, especially at Loud Mackey Arena. Matt Painter with another outstanding, uh, outstanding unit this year. You mentioned the teams they beat. Purdue scored wins over then number 10 Gonzaga. Then number seven Tennessee and number four Marquette. Wow, huh? That's impressive. How about their strength of schedule? Yeah, and the travel <laughs> over there. Uh, Maui Classic was moved over to Honolulu to the University of Hawaii, but uh, it uh, got it done over there. And I think they watched that game last night, uh, kind of a comeback game for them, and uh, they look fresh. And we've been to the Maui Classic, you and I, and uh, just that fire that devastated uh, Lahaina uh, and uh, really all of downtown. Uh, we wish those folks the very best. Absolutely. Uh, a lot of Hawk fans living in that uh, part of the world. That is the U.S. Bank scoreboard update. Coming up next, we'll hear from North Florida head coach Matt Driscoll. He is an engaging guy, great personality, and he's done a heck of a job at North Florida across 15 years. Uh, 8 o'clock tip time tonight for the Hawks and the Ospreys. This is Hawkeye basketball from Lurfield. Are aches, pains, or injuries keeping you on the sidelines? At Athletico, our movement experts are here to help you turn your setbacks into comebacks and create a personalized game plan for your recovery. With no prescription or referral needed, Athletico Physical Therapy is where your comeback story begins. Get started today by scheduling a free assessment at athletico.com. Proud partner of the Iowa Hawkeyes. Does your company attire make you feel like you're always fourth and long? It's time for a change. Hand the ball off to Authentic Brand and watch your team transform into MVPs. On game days, our team dresses like champions in Authentic Brand. Ensure that your company's reputation remains untarnished by using nothing but the label specifically designed to display your company's identity. Ask your supplier for Authentic Brand products and see for yourself why it's more than just a label. It's a statement. Hawk fans, be sure to visit and connect with the official local business partners of the Iowa Hawkeyes, the hotel at Kirkwood Center, Iowa's premier luxury hotel, the Jill Armstrong team with Skogman Realty, the area's premier realtor, and Melrose Meadows, voted Iowa City's best retirement community. Jill Armstrong and her team strive to make every buyer and seller at ease with the real estate process. If you are in the market to buy or sell a home, contact the Jill Armstrong team with Skogman Realty. For all your real estate needs, call 319-631-5455. There's a Honda for every holiday adventure. Whether it's traveling to the holiday family dinner in an efficient Accord hybrid, or heading to a hike to burn it off in a powerful CRV hybrid. Find your new Honda during Happy Honda Days. For a limited time, well qualified buyers can get a 3.9% APR on a 2024 Accord hybrid and a 2024 CRV hybrid. So see your Central Midwest Honda dealer today. Honda gets the Midwest. See dealer for financing details. Lots of insurance companies make promises about how much you can save if you switch over to them. Well, here's our promise. With the West Bend policy, you can save everything. Every memory. Every detail. Everything you've worked so hard for. Once it comes time to actually make a claim, a cheap insurance policy can really cost you. Why not protect everything that matters with a policy from West Bend? Because the worst brings out our best. Visit thesilverlining.com to find out more. 
Hey, it's your friend, Social Media. You know, where I showcase the cool life of sports stars and friends. But don't fall for the editing and good lighting because we all have struggles and challenges like with alcohol or drug use, gambling, or our mental health. Talking about it is a sign of strength. Maybe you don't know who to talk to. Your Life Iowa can give you resources or treatment options. Get free 24-7 confidential support. Call, text, or chat online at yourlifeiowa.org. A message from Iowa HHS. Thank you for joining us on the Iowa Soybean Association pregame show. Iowa, leading the nation in biodiesel production. Welcome back to the Iowa Soybean Association pregame show. Time to hear from our opposing coach tonight, North Florida University and 15-year uh, man, Matt Driscoll. Matt's on deck. Is your small business ready for a big promotion? To support and celebrate small businesses, United Healthcare and Hawkeye Athletics are teaming up for the spotlight on small business sweepstakes. Winners receive radio promotions, social media recognition, and more. To enter, visit HawkeyeSports.com slash UHC. United Healthcare, a proud sponsor of Hawkeye Athletics. Well, North Florida comes in here 4-2. and two. Their best player is a hot shooting guard named Chaz Lanier. Now, if you're my age, you remember the great Bob Lanier of the NBA. And Coach Matt Driscoll says, unfortunately, no relationship, but he's got great pedigree. No, they are not. Actually, his dad was a great player at Lipscomb in our league in the A-Sun. And uh, mom played at uh, uh, Elkhorn State as well, too. So he's got really good lineage. And, you know, last year, our first 14 games in the A-Sun, he scored 45 points. In the last five games, he scored 53 so we kind of had a feeling and then of course because of the transfer portal because one guy's at Oklahoma State one's at South Florida now it really came on to him as far as like here's the deal like you're that dude sure. and because of that I think he felt a little bit against LSU because they kind of gave him the dude treatment and so I would assume you know Fran will do the same thing as far as at some point you got to take somebody away and it's nice when you're the third or fourth option you, you really don't get that that often you know so he's really he's learned how to navigate that as well too and I think our guys are as well because we have so many new pieces in so many important places and you've seen us before obviously we played here we played well uh, several times that we played here but in our offense it's not intricate but it has so many different reads that are so simple that it's sophisticated. And so as you go through that and as you learn through that, LSU obviously is not the best way to learn. Iowa's not the best way to learn. We still have Florida State, Georgia, and Miami coming up as well too. But but with that said, I really like the way in which we have progressed. And obviously the last seven, eight minutes of the LSU game, it showed that these guys don't have quit in them. Coach, uh, you've got your top six averaging eight, nine, ten points, almost double figures. you got to love that kind of balance, even with a star like Chaz. We've always had our championship teams have always been teams that knew how to share the sugar and never were really worried about the spotlight. One year we had to, our greatest player, he was kind of not, didn't have that many pieces around him because they had graduated. So he averaged about 24, 25 a game. So we had to adjust a little bit. But normally it's, it's really any night somebody can get 15 to 20 and the next night they could get four or six, you know, and somebody else is getting 15 to 20. But I think Chaz has been that consistent piece for us. Amitri Moss as well, too, has had a lot of consistency to him as well. It's really hard to come into our program. This is the first time in 11, so over a decade, that we haven't had an all-league player driving the car. And so here's a new guy plus a freshman, Jalen Smith, that are in charge of this Lamborghini, this offense that we've really been flowing with. And speaking of that, your offense has been flowing unbelievably. The way in which you guys score the ball, the rate at which you score the ball, you know, less than 15 seconds of possession. And it really looks like on film, whoever gets the first clean one, though they prefer it to be 20 as often as, and he'd like it to be him too. <laughs> Even his brother thinks he should get him at 20, uh, number 24. But, 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 but your offense, it really doesn't have a dude, but what 23 gives them and what 20 gives them is incredible balance or feel good about themselves knowing that those dudes are going to get theirs and then who else is going to be the next guy? Almost like who's going to be the third guy? That's the way I've watched them on film, the way I've watched them play. You know, we used your, and you were there, we used your Michigan State 
game last year. year. Um, and I'm um, a big yeah, special situation, guys. Yeah. Well, 48 seconds, you're down 10. Yeah, true. And you sent it to overtime. So we use that with our guys. And uh, we actually had that scenario this year. Thanks to North Florida basketball coach Matt Driscoll, his Ospreys, that is a hawk, by the way, getting ready to take on the Hawkeyes. Coming up in just a minute, we'll hear from head coach Fran McCaffrey of Iowa, sponsored by your Iowa John Deere dealers. This is Hawkeye basketball from Learfield. Go to the game to get a game program. You can download it now by visiting the game day page on HawkeyeSports.com. That's right. The game program is now digital and it's free. So check it out. Get the roster, the stats, and fascinating stories about today's matchup. Just go to HawkeyeSports.com and click on game day. If you or someone you know is having thoughts of suicide, experiencing a mental health or substance use crisis, or just need someone to listen, 988 provides a direct connection to free, confidential, and compassionate support. When you call, text, or chat 988 You'll be quickly connected to trained crisis counselors who will listen to your concerns, provide support, and connect you to additional resources if needed. There is hope. You are not alone. For 24-7 support, call or text 988 or chat 988lifeline.org. The silly moments, the proud moments, even the hard moments, they're what make life remarkable. And they're why Wellmark Blue Cross and Blue Shield is here for every moment. Committed to making health care better, more affordable, with more choices for care. And service and coverage that give you peace of mind no matter what comes your way. So you can show up for every tender moment, every brave moment, and every wouldn't miss it for the world moment. Knowing that blue is here for you. Go to wellmark.com slash every moment to find a plan right for you. Are aches, pains, or injuries keeping you on the sidelines? At Athletico, our movement experts are here to help you turn your setbacks into comebacks and create a personalized game plan for your recovery. With no prescription or referral needed, Athletico Physical Therapy is where your comeback story begins. Get started today by scheduling a free assessment at athletico.com. Proud partner of the Iowa Hawkeyes. Bananas are only 39 cents a pound at High V. That's not a sale price. That's the price with the High V Perks membership. And 39 cents a pound is not just the price today or this week, it's the Perks price every day. With the High V Perks membership, you can save on hundreds of products store wide every time you shop and count on Perks prices to stay the same. So if you want to pay less for bananas every day, sign up for High V Perks. It's free and easy. Some restrictions apply. Hawk fans, be sure to visit and connect with the official local business partners of the Iowa Hawkeyes, the hotel at Kirkwood Center, Iowa's premier luxury hotel, the Jill Armstrong team with Skogman Realty, the area's premier realtor, and Melrose Meadows, voted Iowa City's best retirement community. Jill Armstrong and her team strive to make every buyer and seller at ease with the real estate process. If you are in the market to buy or sell a home, contact the Jill Armstrong team with Skogman Realty. For all your real estate needs, call 319-631-5455. Travel Leaders Destinations Unlimited. We provide experiential travel and vacation planning for Hawkeye fans across the state. Contact one of our destination experts to start planning your next trip at duagency.com. Welcome back to Iowa City, Iowa and North Florida. Tipping off a little bit after 8 o'clock, a later starting game tonight to accommodate television. We're going to hear from Iowa coach Fran McCaffrey uh, next. Right now, as a matter of fact, it's time for our John Deere pregame interview with the head coach of the Hawkeyes. Brought to you by the great Iowa John Deere dealers, including K.C. Nielsen in Kanawha. Well, Coach McCaffrey and the Hawkeyes out in San Diego last week, that was about as close to a, 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 as you can get to an NCAA postseason event, at least for the month of November. Uh, the Hawks split a pair of games uh, against two quality opponents, losing to Oklahoma, beating Seton Hall. Coach, what did you learn about your team? How does it benefit the Hawkeyes moving forward? Well, I think, the, you know, the most important thing is you've got to be able to learn from a defeat and then prepare to play somebody the next day the very next day you know and, and process all of that information and our guys did a unbelievable job getting ready for that Seton Hall game very good very well coached team with really good veteran guys uh, you know didn't shoot it well against Oklahoma did some things well did some things we probably need to you know get better at but we did, came back and won, flew back here, and have been locked in on North Florida ever since. 
Coach, you mentioned Seton Hall. Uh, the team shot a season high 56.5%, 21 assists, and 31 made baskets. Uh, through six games now, the Hawks have 114 assists, 52 turnovers. That leads the Big Ten, 17th nationally. Uh, really remarkable for this early in the year. Plus, you're playing eight new faces, uh, uh, drawing significant minutes. What's been the key there? Uh, straight line passing, vision, decision making, all of the above. Yeah, it, it's the people doing it. it. You know, it's nothing other than that. You know, they're all good players. They're all unselfish people. They all have character. They all emphasize winning. And uh, it was a thing of beauty because, you know, we obviously always want to score early in a possession if we can. But if not, we want to score late. We want to move the ball and get a really good shot. And that's that's what we did against Seton Hall. That's why I've been so impressed with uh, DeSante Bowen. Uh, DeSante Bowen, not just Seton Hall, but uh, he's a 44% shooter, uh, 14 of 16 from the foul line, 20 assists, only four turnovers, six steals. He affects the game in a lot of ways, doesn't he? He does. And, you know, and he didn't play as much against Seton Hall. You know, Josh Dix played a little bit more, played really well in that game. But uh, there have been very few players who have been as consistent as DeSante Bowen handling the ball since the start of the season. You know, when you go look at 20 and 4, that's leading the nation, I'm sure. Uh, but he's also getting to the rim. He's also a really good defender. But that's the kind of team we have. You know, All of a sudden, we have a game where, okay, Josh plays a little more than DeSante and plays really well. They're both happy for each other. Yeah, and that, that's a small sophomore recruiting class. We talked about this uh, in week one. You've got to be pleased with their production collectively. Yeah, because they don't play like young guys. They're, they play like veteran guys. You know, they both played a fair amount last year, as I said before. They both should have played more. That's on me. But the bottom line is they play like veterans. They think the game like veterans, and they're just not mistake makers. Speaking of talented guards, North Florida has a Chaz Lanier averaging 16 and 5, 22 made threes, shooting 45%. Uh, how do the Hawks defend him uh, or their leading scorer? Well, we've got to pay a lot of attention to him because he's really good. Uh, he can get to the rim, he can shoot behind screens, he can shoot off the move. He's a really good athlete, he's got good size. So with a guy like that, it's not necessarily the guy who's assigned to him. It's everybody collectively knowing and understanding. You've got to pick him up in transition. You've got to wall him off. And you've got to pay attention to him the entire position until we get the ball back. Coach, with the, with the tournament last week, the long travel out to the West Coast, you've got one game this week uh, with North Florida. W w what's the significance there uh, as it leads into Purdue, Iowa State, and Michigan back to back to back? Yeah, you know, it, it, the schedule is, is not something that we have complete control over. We certainly have some control over it. We made a decision to go out there. We wanted to have a little bit of time when we came back. But, you know, those. Those other TV games, which are the conference games and obviously the Iowa State game, it's always going to fall kind of in that same area. So, uh, you know, we'll just deal with that as it comes. Hawkeyes are averaging a little over seven steals per game, so they're getting it done at both ends of the floor. Scoring, taking good shots, particularly in the Seton Hall game, and uh, stealing the basketball and rebounding, holding their own on the boards at the other end. Coach McCaffrey is sponsored by your Iowa John Deere dealers, including K.C. Nielsen, your premier John Deere dealer, serving northern Iowa and southern Minnesota. K.C. Nielsen offers parts, sales, and service on all John Deere equipment. K.C. Nielsen has been family-owned and operated since 1946. Learn more at kcnielsen.com. Spent a good portion of the morning at the uh, John Deere Dubuque Works, uh, seeing uh, a lot of old guys, uh, a lot of old buddies that uh, I've known for years, including uh, the general manager of the Deere plant in Dubuque, uh, Mark Dixon, great guy. We were there on behalf of the United Way, and we appreciate the support of John Deere, a great uh, corporate and civic-minded citizen. Coming up next, Bobby Hansen has his club car wash keys to the game. This is Hawkeye basketball from Lurfield. The big game. Family. Friends. We know you count on Alliant Energy to deliver the safe, reliable energy you need. Whether you're watching the game, cooking your famous burgers, or leaving a light on for loved ones. For us, it means going beyond the expected to make sure we're planning for the energy you need today and tomorrow. That
That way you can keep your eye on the ball and focus on what's most important to you. Find out more at AlliantEnergy.com slash Powering Beyond. With the Hawkeyes, every pass, shot, layup, and score is more than just part of the game. It's a testament to the teamwork, elbow grease, and can-do attitude it takes to win. In the same way, Case IH knows every successful farm is more than just a farm. It's the product of top-notch tillage, planting, harvesting, hay, and forage equipment at the hands of hardworking growers. Get a slam dunk by visiting your local Case IH dealer or go to caseih.com slash Hawkeyes to learn more. Go Hawks! When it comes to your health, you need the full picture. That means the right diagnosis and the right treatment right from the start. I'm Aaron Bowes, pediatric neurologist with University of Iowa Healthcare. Here, we're working together every day to advance medicine so you can get the best care. With more research, more clinical trials, and more treatment options than anywhere else in the state, the University of Iowa Healthcare is changing medicine and changing lives. Learn more at uihc.org. Draft Day Sports Lounge is the ultimate place to watch the game, have some fun, and show off your golfing skills with Top Golf Swing Suite. Top Golf Swing Suite in Draft Day delivers a one of a kind simulation that's fun for golfers and non golfers alike. Pair that with Draft Day's live sports viewing, local craft beers, and delicious menu, and you have a winning pair. Riverside Casino and Golf Resort, home of the Draft Day Sports Lounge and Top Golf Swing Suite, just minutes south of Iowa City. Bananas are only 39 cents a pound at Hy-Vee. That's not a sale price. That's the price with the Hy-Vee Perks membership. And 39 cents a pound is not just the price today or this week. It's the Perks price every day. With the Hy-Vee Perks membership, you can save on hundreds of products store-wide every time you shop and count on Perks prices to stay the same. So if you want to pay less for bananas every day, sign up for Hy-Vee Perks. It's free and easy. Some restrictions apply. How do you become America's best-selling brand? Let's break it down. Innovative tech means smarter and safer driving. Intelligent all-wheel drive will keep you ready for anything. And built Ford Tough Trucks will always get the job done. Plus, come into your local Ford store today and get super low APR financing, big cash back, and great lease offers on Ford's full line of cars, trucks, and SUVs. That's Ford, and that's how you become America's best-selling brand. Sales claim based on calendar year sales. This is the Iowa Soybean Association pregame show, delivering solutions for every life, every day. And these are Bobby Hansen's keys to a Hawkeye victory tonight over University of North Florida out of the uh, Atlantic Sun Conference. Uh, 10, 12 schools in that league that comprise uh, the six or seven states in the southeast, including obviously Florida, Georgia, Carolinas. They actually stretch as far west as Arkansas, so they've got a big footprint. Bobby's keys to the game are brought to you by the official car wash of the Iowa Hawkeyes, Club Car Wash, with unlimited membership starting at just $20 a month. There's no better time to join the club. Visit clubcarwash.com and find a location near you. Yeah, you heard uh, everybody talk about what North uh, Florida is all about, and that's the three-point line, so that's the number one key here tonight. No secret, they like to shoot threes. Half their field goal attempts are from beyond the arc, so about 35% shooters. The percentage is not great, but if they get hot, Gary, obviously they can hurt you. they got the old puncher's chance of, uh, of knocking down shots. They have made a three-point field goal in every game since 1996. It's 800. It's amazing. And 16 straight games. So maybe we can break that record tonight and put some D on them. For, for Iowa, have much better shooting uh, in, in their last win versus Seton Hall. So let's keep an eye on this stat right here. Defensively, you got to close out under control, run them off that three-point line, watch them warm up here. That's all they do is shoot threes. So um, you got you got to be ready for that. And it's going to be no secret that's going to be the key to their game. Second key is going to be rebounds. Long shots lead to long rebound bounces. All five Hawkeyes need to be on the glass, be quick to the long ones that are out there up for grabs. The 50-50 balls, Gary, that can lead to runouts and fast breaks for the Hawkeyes. So, need a great job team rebounding. They've been doing a really good job to start the season in these six games. The Hawks on the glass. And we're a little bit, you know, not, we're not big, but you, you got guys like Peyton Sanford as your leading rebounder with eight rebounds a game. So, you got to keep that up. And the third key will be the start of this game. Get the energy up early. Don't let North Florida, these Ospreys, believe that they can stay with you. You got to tack in the open court. Share the basketball. As you mentioned, with, with Coach McCaffrey, 20 assists on 
from 31 made shots is great basketball. It's fun to watch when guys are sharing it. So when the Hawks rebound, run, their whole game picks up. But you got to defend dribble penetration here tonight. A lot of these threes by North Florida come off dribble penetration, the drive and kicks. You mentioned the rebounding. Iowa definitely has a size advantage tonight. Uh, North Florida, no starter taller than 6'7", but they do have a lot of 6'4 to 6'6", guys that can run and, and, and get up and leave the floor. Bobby's car wash, club car wash, keys to the game, a courtesy of club car wash with unlimited membership starting at just $20 a month. No better time to join the club. Give them a call first thing tomorrow morning. Better yet, you can log on to clubcarwash.com right now and find a location nearest you. Hawk fans, experience your home away from home at Coralville's finest all-sweet hotels. The Homewood Suites and Home 2 Suites by Hilton each offer guests spacious suites, complimentary breakfast, 24-hour fitness center, pool, hot tub, guest laundry, and convenient locations. Let their warm and friendly staff take care of you and your family when you visit Hawkeye Country. Stay where the Hawkeye Radio Network team stays. The Homewood Suites and Home 2 Suites by Hilton. Counted down to kickoff at 8 o'clock. The Hawks and uh, North Florida. Each team has won four times. Hawks are 4-2. and two. The Ospreys are 4-3. and three. The Mid-American Energy starting lineups and the Farmers State Bank tip-off are coming up. This is Hawkeye Basketball from Learfield. Equity salutes today's hero of the game. As a proud sponsor of the ongoing recognition of our military during Hawkeye games this season, please join American Equity in thanking all who have served our country. American Equity is more than just retirement savings and income products. They are committed to providing you best-in-class service and high-quality retirement income that helps deliver the independence to dream and reach your goals. To learn more about American Equity, please visit their website at American-Equity.com. What are you craving? The Wig and Pen in Ankeny, across from DMAC, is proud to offer dine-in and carry-out. Home of the famous Flying Tomato Pizza and Chicago-style deep dish, the Wig has all of your favorites, including thin crust pizza, appetizers, lots of sandwiches like the Turkey Club and Reuben, soups and salads you'll love, and a full bar. Call to order or just come on in for lunch and dinner. The Wig and Pen in Ankeny, what are you craving? Right now, you are not in the crowded Carver Hawkeye Arena, but you could be. You're not cheering a Hawkeye steal, fast break, and slam dunk, but you could be. Play the Hawkeye Gold Scratch Ticket, and you could win a VIP game day experience to see the Iowa men's basketball team. The countdown to Carver promotion from the Iowa Lottery lets you be a part of the action. To enter your ticket and see details, visit ialottery.com slash VIP. Hawk fans, be sure to visit and connect with these local business partners of the Iowa Hawkeyes, located in the Des Moines area, Car Law, Community Choice Credit Union, and Royal Flooring. Royal Flooring has everything you and your home needs from the floors up. We proudly serve Des Moines area homes as your local one-stop shop for flooring, tile appliances, cabinetry, countertops, and more. Visit shoproyalflooring.com to give your home the royal treatment today. Welcome back to Carver Hawkeye Arena, where the Hawkeyes are set to take on North Florida out of the uh, A-Sun. Let's give you tonight's Mid-American Energy starting lineups, courtesy of our friends at Mid-American, longtime supporter of Hawkeye basketball. Mid-American Energy makes reliability a slam dunk with a balanced energy mix of wind, solar, and other sources that ensure you always have the power you count on. Learn more at midamericanenergy.com. For the run and gun, Ospreys of North Florida out of Jacksonville. Head coach is Matthew Driscoll. He's in his 15th year. They're four and three. Have yet to uh, start not, uh, conference play, but boy, they are uh, they're running the gauntlet, uh, Bobby. You heard Coach Driscoll say in his pregame comments that they've already played LSU and tonight Iowa. They got uh, Georgia coming up, uh, Miami, some other heavyweights before they get into conference play and. 
He's going to learn a lot about his team between now and then. Yeah, he learned a lot about his team in the last game. They lost it. They were down by 20 or 30 points at LSU, but they made a frantic comeback at the end with that three-point shooting. So that was the first big test. This is another big one for them tonight. And then at Florida State, at Georgia, at Miami over the Christmas break. <laughs> at Florida State, at Georgia, at Miami. Yeah, that's that's a pretty good run. That's coming up after they played uh, a number of Division One schools, including Iowa. Uh, here uh, this evening, uh, they were home to the University of Maine, then at LSU. Lost that game by 12. And the Hawkeyes tonight. They'll start at a guard, uh, their best player, 6'4", junior from Nashville, Tennessee. Chaz Lanier, 16 points, 5 rebounds, shooting almost 90% from the foul line. He, he knows where the basket is, that's for sure. Dorian James is a 6'7 guard forward, redshirt senior from Winter Haven, Florida. He's put up 9 points and 7 rebounds a game. Their leading rebounder in the early season. He's a 91% free. They're, they're a great free throw shooting team. They're right around 80% as a team. So keep them off the line. Nate Litteros, 6'6 graduate student from Seward, Nebraska, by way of Longwood College. Seven points, three rebounds a game. Nate Litteros, a 6'6 grad transfer. Oscar Berry is a guard forward. Transferred in from uh, FDU. 6'5", junior from Melbourne, Australia, putting up four points, a couple rebounds a game. And uh, Amitri Moss is a six-foot junior guard, Clarksville, Tennessee, junior college transfer from the State College of Florida. And he's off to a good start, 10 points, three rebounds, 92% from the free throw line. All these guys are fabulous free throw shooters. And Coach Driscoll will bring uh, Josiah Miles and Ja NZ off the bench, two gifted 6'4", uh, 6'5", six, six, youngsters, one a sophomore, the other a freshman. Uh, NZ is averaging 10 points uh, for the Ospreys. That is the North Florida starting five. For the Hawkeyes, we don't anticipate any changes, nor should there be. Desante Bowen will be at one guard. Off to a great start, the sophomore from Boston. Seven points, couple rebounds, three assists a game, and 88% from the foul line. Tony Perkins at the off guard, the 6'4 senior from Indianapolis, is averaging 12.6 boards. Peyton Sanford at a forward, 6'7 junior from Waukee. Peyton at 15 points, nine rebounds. Iowa's leading rebounder, and he's uh, whistling free throws through at a 95% clip. Patrick McCaffrey at a forward. 6'9", 245. P-Max, a redshirt senior from Iowa City West. Another double-figure scorer at 11 points, 4 rebounds. And Ben Pricky, grad transfer from Valparaiso, native of Edmonton, Alberta, Canada. 6'9", 240. 18 points, 5 rebounds. 65% from the foul line. That will get better. Bobby, what do you like uh, now that we've had a couple weeks to watch Ben in competition, at least for seven, uh, six or seven games? Uh, you know, we read about him coming in, watched some tape on him in his days at Valpo. Uh, he hasn't disappointed. No, not at all. He's been impressive is what he's been, especially over at Creighton when he played against big Ryan Kalkbrenner, uh, who's a big seven-foot uh, All-American candidate. Ben had the best of that one, and he pulled him away from the basket. That mid-range game is what you like about Ben Cricky and his consistency. You know what you're going to get out of Ben, kind of like Phil Perbracci. You know what you're going to get every night out there. So it's uh, been a great, great, fine, great addition to this Hawkeye basketball team. As usual, Fran will come off the bench with sophomore guard Josh Dix of Council Bluffs. Had a really good uh, game against uh, Seton Hall. And then the four, the four freshmen, Brock Harding. Laji Dembele, Price Sanford, and Owen Freeman, 6'10", youngster from Moline High School, twice Big Ten Freshman of the Year. Averaging almost 10 points a game, Owen Freeman is off the bench. I love the way he runs the floor, too. He can rebound as well. Good moves at, at the basket, too. Those are the Mid-American Energy starting lineups. Up next is the Farmer State Bank tip-off of Iowa, North Florida. This is Hawkeye basketball from Learfield. To anyone passing through our state, fields and fields of corn might be what they see. But the people who call Iowa home know it's so much more. Corn is ethanol, a homegrown, renewable fuel. Corn is delicious pork, beef, poultry, and dairy. Corn is in 4,000 products we rely on every day. So yeah, our highway views are full of corn, and we're proud of it. 
because corn grows Iowa. Show your support for Iowa corn farmers at iowacorn.org backslash fan of corn. When the game goes into overtime. But... The game goes into overtime. The choice to enjoy is easy. Bud Light, easy to drink, easy to enjoy. Order Bud Light online today. Enjoy responsibly. Anheuser-Busch Bud Light Beer, St. Louis, Missouri. Pickup truck, sports car, motorcycle, minivan, townhouse, two-story, farmhouse, fixer-upper. What you drive and where you live is different for everyone. So it's important to have insurance that fits your needs and is just right for you. At Shelter Insurance, we understand that. Which is why our agents help you design a comprehensive auto, home, and life insurance plan. Insurance that fits just right. Find an agent at shelterinsurance.com to get started. We're your shield. We're your shelter. It takes hard work to be the best in the game. Planning. Commitment. Resilience. Sweat. That's why Old Dominion Freight Line, the number one national LTL carrier for quality, works hard to be the best in the game and is proud to support those striving to be the best in theirs. Old Dominion Freight Line, official freight carrier of Iowa Athletics, helping the world keep promises. Draft Day Sports Lounge is the ultimate place to watch the game, have some fun, and show off your golfing skills with Top Golf Swing Suite. Top Golf Swing Suite in Draft Day delivers a one of a kind simulation that's fun for golfers and non golfers alike. Pair that with Draft Day's live sports viewing, local craft beers, and delicious menu, and you have a winning pair. Riverside Casino and Golf Resort, home of the Draft Day Sports Lounge and Top Golf Swing Suite, just minutes south of Iowa City. With the Hawkeyes, every pass, shot, layup, and score is more than just part of the game. It's a testament to the teamwork, elbow grease, and can-do attitude it takes to win. In the same way, Case IH knows every successful farm is more than just a farm. It's the product of top-notch tillage, planting, harvesting, hay, and forage equipment at the hands of hardworking growers. Get a slam dunk by visiting your local Case IH dealer or go to caseih.com slash Hawkeyes to learn more. Go Hawks! On the Hawkeye Sports Network, from Learfield, Hawkeye Basketball is brought to you by 988 Lifeline. There is hope. 24-7. Call, text, or chat 988. West Bend, the silver lining. Mid-American Energy. Look up, look out for overhead power lines. Visit midamericanenergy.com for electrical safety tips. Bud Light. Easy to drink, easy to enjoy. Iowa John Deere dealers, proud sponsors of Hawkeye Basketball. By your local Ford dealers. And by Authentic Brand, unique Hawkeye apparel at Authentic-Brand.com. It's game time. Out of Peyton Sanford. Across the court to McCaffrey. Here's Sanford for three more. Yes, sir! Here before. And a foul! You're listening to healthy coverage of the Iowa Hawkeyes with Wellmark Blue Cross and Blue Shield. Here's Gary Dolphin and Bobby Hansen. About ready to go uh, with the Hawks. Final non-conference game. Well, not exactly final non-conference game, but the final one before they step out and into Big Ten play for a week with Iowa State sandwiched in between Michigan and Purdue. Hawks still have a very attractive uh, non-conference schedule in late December. Let's pause 10 seconds for station identification before we enjoy our national anthem. 10-second ID break here on the Hawkeye Radio Network. Hawkeyes and the Ospreys. Two Hawks. Feathers of a different color. Ospreys love to dive into the ocean and lakes and, and feed on a steady diet of fish. That'll keep you in shape. You bet it will. 200 miles an hour and that beat hits that one. Down there in Jacksonville. <laughs> on the beach. On the beach. So singing our national anthem is Pat Foley. I'm guessing that's not the long time. Chicago, like Chicago Blackhawks 
outstanding play-by-play -play man, but this Pat Foley also has a great voice for singing. Let's enjoy our national anthem. At this time, we ask that you please rise, remove your hats as we honor America with the singing of our national anthem performed this evening by Pat Foley. Oh, say can you see by the dawn's early light what so proudly we hail at the twilight's last gleaming whose broad stripes and bright stars through the perilous fight or the ramparts we watch were so gallantly streaming and the rocket's red glare the bombs bursting in air gave proof through the night that our flag was Oh, say, does that star-spangled banner yet wave o'er the land of the free and the home of the brave? Great job, Pat Foley. Our officials tonight, signed by the Big Ten Conference. Good evening, everyone, and welcome to Media Gordon. The head referee is Kelly Pfeiffer. He's a Big Ten, longtime Big Ten official. Tim Comer and Shane Staggs will uh, join uh, referee Pfeiffer on the floor. Kelly's the referee, Comer and, St and Staggs, the umpires. A couple of new guys. I know Kelly, but the other two seem to be new. Tim Comer has been around. I've seen him do other leagues. I think Shane Staggs is new to the Big Ten. See what they got. Yeah. Bring your A game. Kelly Pfeiffer, of course, famous for getting in the stare down with Fran uh, last year here in uh, was Kelly, center floor. It? Yeah, it was Kelly, yeah. Down the baseline. That, you know? that game didn't end uh, pleasantly for the Hawkeyes. And Well, I mean, that's that Fran. That's Fran, yeah. He's going to fight for his guys. And let's see if we can give you an update on the uh, U.S. Bank scoreboard. Ohio State was leading comfortably in the second half over uh, Central Michigan. North Carolina, midway through the second half, Tennessee's come back, still trails uh, UNC and 10th ranked Tennessee. It's the heels 82, Tennessee 69. Virginia has an 11 point lead on 14th ranked Texas A&M, 52-41. That with Six minutes to play in the game. Villanova fell to St. Joe's, upset. 18th ranked Nova goes down to St. Joe's, 78 65. Battle for playground rights in Philadelphia. James Madison, ranked number 22, beat Buffalo, 81 66. Duke later is at Arkansas, and Colorado, Colorado State also uh, later. And we'll get that Ohio State score here shortly. Ohio State's playing Buffalo, and that update is 83-57. Um, Buckeyes comfortably in front of Central Michigan. 83-57, minute and a half to go. Right here, the Hawkeyes are about to entertain North Florida, and that'll do it for our uh, U.S. Bank scoreboard right up to date. did I do with my all Big Ten selections today? They're here. Um, the usual suspects. Cooper DeGene, Torrey Taylor uh, were named all Big Ten. 
In fact, Cooper DeGene was named the Big Ten uh, Defensive Back of the Year. Well deserved. Yeah, the Tatum Whitson Big Ten Defensive Back of the Year. And the Rogers Dwight, Tim Dwight, Big Ten Return Specialist of the Year. Good for Cooper. Well deserved. Tory Taylor was recognized as the uh, Edelman Fields Putter of the Year in uh, the Big Ten. In all, between yesterday and today, 20 Hawkeyes have been accorded all Big Ten recognition. See Phil Parker, he was one of the four finalists, maybe? Five finalists for the Broyles? Yeah, I think they're down to two or three now. Yeah. Uh, DeGene is also one of three finalists for the Jim Thorpe Award, which goes to uh, the nation's outstanding defensive back. We'll run down those names for you at halftime as to which Hawkeyes uh, were receiving mention. Most of them on the defense, and rightfully so, but several offensive linemen. Lee Sean Williams, of course, having a great year. And it's not done yet. Far from finished. Right now, we're talking Hawkeye basketball, and we're ready to go. North Florida comes out in the uh, dark navy blue with gray and white trim. The Hawkeyes wearing the home white with the uh, black and gold trim. Ben Cricky at 6'9 will jump uh, against Dorian Jones at 6'7. Dorian from right there in Winter Haven. Atlantic Sun schools like uh, Bellarmine and Kennesaw State, Lipscomb, Stetson, and their nickname is? The Mad Hatters. The Mad Hatters. North, Central Florida. North Alabama. Kirk Queen. Spira, number four on that A-Sun all-time wins list. That's right. Uh, Kirk Spira is here, although I think Central Florida is now in the, uh, they in the Big 12. Getting moved around. All yeah. this conference realignment. Central Florida, though, they're, they're in one of the major Power Five conferences. Here we go. Kelly Piper flips the ball up in the air, and Dorian Jones a little quicker off his feet. And the opening tap controlled by Dorian James, excuse me. Controlled by the Ospreys. With it in the front court, Nate Litteris. Here's the first three of the night, and no good off the left of the iron. Tip up, no good by James, and the Hawkeyes get the rebound. First missed jump shot by Oscar Berry, the Young man out of Melbourne, where Tory Taylor's from. There's a near steal and a pass by Bowen, in, intended for Cricky, but Hawks get it under control. Cricky high post left, backs the dribble down or backs his man down, and then was whirling for an easy layup and lost the handle. Running are the Ospreys at the other end. Chaz Lanier, he's going to be looking to get his shot. Here comes a three, and it's good. Lanier drove it in deep, kicked it to the wing, and Litteris knocks it down. Yeah, he's a good shooter out there. He only averages six points, the junior does, but what we talked about, drive and then kick it back out for the threes. Here's a jump shot in the lane by Patrick McCaffrey. Missed bad. Didn't even draw iron. Wide open look from 10 feet. That's a little tight out of the gate. 3-0 North Florida. Litteris. Here's Lanier turning the corner, drives inside, scores the layup. What body control. Really good drive that time, but you got to stop dribble penetration out there. The Hawks just let him go down the middle of the paint and kind of made a circus shot to, to get the points. 5-0 the visitors. Asante Bowen gets three back with a corner jump shot. That's a nice drive and kick for the Hawkeyes. Penetration. Asante wide open in the near corner. Good to see Asante get that uh, uh, first one to drop for him. He usually get, gets going if he can get to see one go through the net. Uh, Mitri Moss drove high post right, then kicked it back out. Now a traveling violation. Actually a sideline violation. Called on uh, North Florida across away from us, and they get Chaz Lanier not knowing where he was at. Got the turnover. The Hawk basketball to Sante Bowen on the dribble. North Florida averages 12 turnovers. Here are the Hawks on the attack. Cricky trying to tie it up. Nope. Pulls the shot back down, and then... Uh, Gets the ball back from Bowen. Asante posting up inside. Goes to the corner. Tony for three. It's good. Back-to-back -back threes by Iowa. And there goes that 5 nothing North Florida lead. Really good find that time by Desante Bowen. He faked the pass out to Patrick. Took the defense with him. Open in the far left corner. Tony Perkins. Amitri Moss. Crossover dribble. Throws it back out to Litteris. Top of the ring. He throws it up there. Good again. Splashes down another three. And he's already at his average. Got six. A three at the other end is good. Patrick McCaffrey regains the lead for Iowa. 9-8 Hawkeyes. Five three-point field goals made by both teams. Three by the Hawks. Two by the Ospreys. 
Left-handed dribble by Dorian James. Returns to the center of the floor from the left wing. Now hands off to Amitri Moss. He got in deep. Throws it back to the wing. Now they got Oscar Berry covered up. Back inside it goes right of the lane for Dorian James. He elbows his way in on Cricky. Drop step once, twice. Jump shot no good. Great defense yeah. by Cricky. Held his ground right there. Kit went straight up and down. Forced the shot to be a little bit short. And then boxed out and got the board. Hawks are getting into a rhythm now. Tony with a pop-up jumper in the lane. Good. Took a trip around the horn. Dropped down through. The Hawks up 11-8 after spotting uh, North Florida the first five points of the game. Iowa scored 11 of the next 14 and lead it by three. Made four of their last four field goal attempts. Near corner is Oscar Berry in front of the Iowa bench. Peyton Sanford shadowing him. On the wing it goes far side of the court for Amitri Moss. Moss crossover dribble gets inside on the much taller Peyton Sanford but hits the left-handed jump shot. Elevated nicely. Six foot tall is all. Perkins right back and scores off the window for Iowa. Hard to keep up. Yeah, it is. It is both teams wanting to go, but uh, have a nice little shot there by Tony. Another hoop for him. He's got seven. 13-10. Iowa's lead stays at three. Lanier gets in deep. Throws to the near corner and a foul called on Peyton Sanford. He took the uh, shot fake and then banged into the driver once he put the ball on the floor. Not a shooting foul. It'll be North Florida basketball. Underneath out of bounds. Well, you got to be under control in those closeouts. Just a high hand. Move your feet. That time, Peyton got a little extended. Here's a pop-up jumper. No good in the lane. Boy, the Hawks got caught looking the other way. Jump shot, fortunately, missed by Litteris on a beautiful dish by Moss. Iowa with a rebound. Cricky. High post right for Patrick McCaffrey. He gets into the paint. Looks for a cutter. Nobody home. Out of Peyton Sanford. Shot fake. He drives inside. Misses the runner off glass. Rebounded by North Florida. Cleared out of there by Litteris. 15 and a half minutes to go in the opening period. Back and forth we go. Here's a drive inside. Losing the ball up uh, in the middle uh, of the lane, but getting it back in the corner is Amitri Moss. 15 to shoot for North Florida, so the shot clock not a factor yet. Here's James. Underhands the ball to Lanier. Cricky has him all tied up, and now a run a foul by Bowen. He ran into the pass catcher. Second foul on the Hawkeyes. Not a shooting foul. Shot clock will reset to 20, and North Florida will have the ball when play resumes with 15 minutes, 17 seconds to go. Opening half. Boy, I, I know Iowa can keep this pace up in <laughs> North Florida. Um, if they make threes, that's the only way that, that they can, Gary. But uh, the Hawks are so much better when they get out in the open court and run. Attack. Iowa 13, and North Florida 10. Not quite five minutes gone in the opening half. Hawkeye basketball is presented by Walmart. Blue Cross and Blue Shield. This is Hawkeye Basketball from Learfield. When the game goes into overtime. But... The game goes into overtime. The choice to enjoy is easy. Bud Light. Easy to drink. Easy to enjoy. Order Bud Light online today. Enjoy responsibly. Anheuser-Busch Bud Light Beer, St. Louis, Missouri. Whether you're building a backyard fence for your family's new best friend or firing up the excavator for your next commercial project, a free and simple call can save you from expensive fines and even save your life. Call 811 at least two days before you start your next project to have underground utility lines located and marked. At MidAmerican Energy, your safety is our number one priority. So, make it your priority to call 811 before you dig. Paid for by the customers of MidAmerican Energy. The silly moments, the proud moments, even the hard moments, they're what make life remarkable. And they're why Wellmark Blue Cross and Blue Shield is here for every moment. Committed to making healthcare better, more affordable, with more choices for care. And service and coverage that give you peace of mind no matter what comes your way. So you can show up for every tender moment, every brave moment, and every wouldn't miss it for the world moment. Knowing that Blue is here for you. Go to wellmark.com slash every moment to find a plan right for you. Four and a half minutes in, the Hawkeyes have a three-point lead, 13-10 over North Florida. Wednesday night, college basketball from Carver Hawkeye Arena. Uh, North Florida scored the first five. Iowa scored 11 of the next 14, Bobby, and 
Led at 11-8. They've maintained that three-point lead. Yeah, just kind of got out of the gate a little bit slow there. The first three-pointer made by Lateris and then Lanier on the nifty drive that you called there, Gary. But then DeSante Bowen, Tony Perkins, Patrick McCaffrey, all with threes to, to light up the Hawkeyes there. So uh, they got their legs underneath them now coming back from uh, California. And they know the game plan, what these guys want to do. These Ospreys, they want to shoot threes. And here we go. North Florida ball on the shot clock reset to 22nd. Iowa leading 13-10. On the wing, Amitri Moss, back center of the floor. He goes. Hawks in zone. To Litteris. Back to Moss. Moss works the dribble in on Desante Bowen. Tried to lean into the lane. Desante stayed right with him. Kept his feet on the floor. Here's a baseline jumper. No good shot clock violation, but a foul called as Patrick McCaffrey grabbed the ball. Just into the game, John uh, Ja NZ, his first foul. He plays a lot, averages 10 points, three rebounds. 6'4, 225. Talk about a fullback body. And he's in the game for North Florida and head coach Matt Driscoll. Hawks look to uh, extend the lead to five. And with that, a near turnover. Peyton Sanford ran it down, a deflected pass before it got over the timeline. Gets it to Cricky, left of the lane. He's got a size advantage. Drives in, bangs into his defender. Shot up over the top of Berry is no good. Good defense by North Florida. A lot of contact. We play on. Back yeah, quickly as Lanier got away with a shove off and hit the jump shot. He's Third player. Team. He's yeah. a handful. You got to get him under control. Long and lanky. He plays a lot bigger than he is. Peyton Sanford gets the basket. Baseline right. 17-footer. He's so much better when he doesn't think about the shot. Just let it go. Good one. Hard dribble on the baseline side. Got to the short corner. Went straight up and down. Gets his first hoop. Hawks back up three. Here's a left wing three. No good. Forced up there by Jake Vanderheiden. Off the bench. Sanford leads the charge back and throws it away. Chaz Lanier with a steal around Patrick McCaffrey and a dunk at the other end. 15-14. Iowa's lead is one. But Bowen all the way back for the Hawkeye. He scores. They can't find a, a smattering of defense at either end of the floor. No. <laughs> that time DeSante just uh, made a nice move, though, once he got to the basket to the whirl and the fall away. Heavy traffic jam right of the lane. Dribbling into the paint. And a steal by Iowa. 13-17 to play. Turnover North Florida. Patrick McCaffrey comes back with a running hook right of the lane. No good. And bringing the ball back is Amitri Moss. All the way ran by two or three Hawkeyes and laid it up and in. Fran McCaffrey can't believe it. <laughs> yeah, they just the ball looked like he double dribbled it at half court is what Fran's looking at. But uh, the Hawks a little tardy getting back on D. 17-16 Iowa. Bowen for three. No good. Short. And the rebound hauled off by Nate Litteris. Grad transfer. He's a Nebraska youngster out of Seward, Nebraska. So here's North Florida shooting for the lead. Drive in deep by NZ. Now throws high post left for Moss. Long three is an air ball. And that's out of bounds to the Hawkeyes. Wholesale substitutions for both teams. Josh Dix comes and gets uh, Bowen. Patrick McCaffrey is out in favor of Owen Freeman. And let's see. We've got uh, for North Florida, Josiah Miles, a freshman from Miami Country Day High School, better known for its football. Trent Coleman, a 6'6 junior from Ridgeland, Mississippi, and Southwest Mississippi Community College is into the game. And I think that's uh, the new faces. Dix works to dribble into the front court for the Hawkeyes with 12.26 to go first half. And Iowa leading by one. Here's Freeman. He's held as he whirled baseline left. Got around the defender, Trent Coleman, and then got grabbed by Coleman, his first. Seems to be a go-to move for Owen Freeman when he's on either block, Gary. He fakes to the middle of the paint and then spins on the baseline side. Had great success in San Diego with that move. He's quick enough to do that. Here's Tony Perkins with a jump shot on the inbounds play, drawn up by Fran McCaffrey, left of the lane. Tony's got a hot start here. Yeah, he really does. Tony Perkins now. I got him down with uh, nine points. Hawkeyes extend the lead back to three, 19-16. Here's NZ, a crossover dribble, gets down the left side of the lane, misses the jump shot. It's tipped to Dix. The Hawks are running the other way. Perkins, a deep three in transition. Good! Way out in the left wing. Timeout, Matt Driscoll. 
He can read his lips. Guys, you got to get back off makes and misses. Yeah, Tony Perkins, hot start. Five out of five, Gary. 12 points, made both his three-point field goal attempts, playing under control. Farmers State Bank brings you the start of every Iowa basketball game. Speaking of great starts, earn $250 when you open an eligible checking account at the Tiffin branch or online at Farmers State Bank. Get rewarded for banking with FSB. Visit myfsbonline.com for complete details. Subject to approval. Minimum $50 deposit requires e-statements and direct deposit. Member FDIC. Thank you, Farmers State Bank, for your support. Uh, Hawkeye basketball. This is Hawkeye basketball presented by Wellmark Blue Cross Blue Shield from Learfield. Travel Leaders Destinations Unlimited. We provide experiential travel and vacation planning for Hawkeye fans across the state. Contact one of our destination experts to start planning your next trip at duagency.com. Facing a criminal charge or complicated family law situation? Our law firm has the trial experts you need. As experienced trial attorneys, we understand how much is on the line. Go to carlawiowa.com for a free consultation. That's car with two R's, lawiowa.com. What happens when you call your insurance company? If you have water in your basement, press 1. Most big companies have a recorded message or an app. If you are in your living room and see sky when you look up, press 2. But when something bad happens, you just want to talk to a person. On a day like that, that phone line can end up feeling like a lifeline. At a time like that, you want a company like West Bend. Because the worst brings out our best. If there is a tree in your bedroom, press 3. Visit thesilverlining.com to find out more. If you're looking for the perfect place to host your holiday party, look no further. Come to Bumps at Finkbine. Have a good time as our new chef, Rick McCombs, provides an unforgettable experience. Don't forget about Thirsty Thursday Super Social Hour where Bumps offers buy one, get one free on domestic beer bottles, house wine, well cocktails, and appetizers. Not only is Bumps the ideal spot for Hawkeye pre-gaming, they also offer a fantastic Sunday brunch. Bumps is your one-stop spot for great food and a great time. Go to Finkbine.com for more information. Hawkeyes in North Florida off to a hot start shooting the basketball. Bobby, we talked all pregame about North Florida. They're averaging almost 11 made threes a game. They're they're putting up close to 20, 25 shots from distance. And yet it's Iowa that's had the hot hand from uh, way out. They really have Tony Perkins uh, leading the way there with two made three-point field goals. He got one by Patrick and one by DeSante Bowens. That, that's four out of five, 80% from deep for the Hawkeyes. And uh, the friendly confines of Carver Hawkeye Arena. Hawks finding it to their liking. Hawk fans, you can drive your team to a win this season, filling up with unleaded 88 from Quick Rewards at any Quick Star location. Fueled up with eight gallons or more of unleaded 88. And you'll be automatically entered for a chance to win great prize packages throughout the season. Quick Star, proud partner of Hawkeye Basketball. Quick Star and Quick Rewards. Everything's quick at Quick Star. Hawks with a 1 2 2 full court press after the Tony Perkins made three. 11 49 to go. First half. And they just do beat the 10 second violation. Across the midcourt stripe. Chaz Lanier, their leading scorer, backs the dribble out. He's got six points. He is a good-looking player. And he's keeping the ball. Drives it in deep on Dix. Shot fake, set, step back, jumper's good. He's got eight. Worked that one right down the shot clock all the way to the end. 11.23 to play in the half. The Iowa lead is 4, 22-18. Here's a shot fake, a jump shot in the lane by Owen Freeman. No good. And he is uh, working over, Bobby, to say the... At least 6'8", Jake Vanderheiden. Oh, wait a minute. They got uh, Josiah Miles and not Vanderheiden. Owen does a good job. He's a young player, just a freshman, but he's got the moves around the basket, either side of the lane there, right block, left block, but he takes his time, Gary. That, that's what makes him so good. He surveys what's got him. He feels the defender behind him and then usually spins away from him. 60% free thrower makes the first. Set up the best zone defense from home heating costs this winter, folks. Tune up your furnace, seal drafts around your home, and visit midamericanenergy.com to find more ways to keep warm with less energy. That's always a change saver. Owen makes both free throws, 24-18 Iowa, 11-10 to play first half. Here are the Ospreys on the flight. 
Center floor for Trent Coleman. Now a deep three, no good, but Tony Perkins jumped into Nate Litteris. The grad transfer. Or is that? Is that Litteris? Make sure I got my numbers straight. Fran McCaffrey's calling that a moving players in and out. Terrible shot uh, or a terrible call. Jalen Smith. Yeah, it though, looks like it's Jalen Smith. A freshman. freshman. Yeah. Heady play right there. Yeah. Through the three fouls. He drew contact from Tony. Fran didn't think it was enough for the foul, but just a 43% free thrower. So finally somebody that struggled at the foul line for this team. Misses the first, makes the second. 24-19. Iowa's lead is five. And he misses the third, so one of three. Oh, boy, they get the offensive rebound and then throw it away. Nice rebound there off the offensive glass by Josiah Miles. It bounced long. The Hawks had him blocked out, Gary, but it just bounced over his head, and the Osprey went and got it. Yeah, he threw it to a teammate who wasn't anticipating the pass. 10.55 to play first half. Hawkeyes with the lead. Now North Florida's in a zone. Here's Cricky. He misses the jumper off glass left of the lane, but he's fouled. Fran McCaffrey is not happy with his guys and the way they're attacking that zone that time. Didn't have the head up, yeah, because Owen Freeman had it, had all of them beat down there, and he had a smaller man on his backside. Fran wanted to throw that ball in there and let him score. Ben Cricky will step to the line and shoot two. Ben's getting good looks. They just aren't falling for him. He makes the first. First point of the night. Hawkeye basketball is sponsored by U.S. Cellular. He's a proud sponsor of the Hawks. U.S. Cellular wants you to make the most of today by choosing game day traditions first and scrolling later. U.S. Cellular built for us. 25-19 Iowa. One more coming for Ben. You know, might get him going now after two made free throws. 26-19. Perkins is at the front of that 1-2-2. Two, two. And they better hurry. Lanier does Nearly. just, again, beats the 10-second violation. Here's a three aired out from the right wing. Put back, no good. Rebounded up and good. A third time by Josiah Miles. He just stayed with it. And the smaller Ospreys out rebounding on. Yeah, the shot came off really hard, long, uh, that three-point attempt. And those are t sometimes tough to corral, Gary. But Miles right there, uh, young man off the bench, Josiah Miles gets the basket and the end one coming. And the foul was called uh, Peyton on Peyton Sanford. Peyton his second. Second. So he's done for the half with 10.31 to go. So that's a double whammy. Gave him three cracks on the, on the glass. And Sanford gets his... Second foul, and the free throw is good by Josiah Miles. So he gets the and one, and just like that, it's a four-point Iowa lead. 26-22. Here's a bad pass by Dix. Picked off by Miles again. 6'6 six, six freshman. Wow, this kid's a player. 205 pounds to Lanier in the center of the floor. He's taken Dix in deep again, backs the dribble out. They go left side with 12 to shoot to Nate Litteris. Now back to Lanier. He's doubled. Now picked up by Cricky. Drives inside. Lost the ball. A little too cute. Going one on three. Perkins, though, misses the runner left of the lane on the break. And the rebound hauled out of there by Miles. To a trailing Litteris. He's a good three-point shooter. Goes in deep on Cricky. Throws to the near corner. This is Miles. He's got a smaller Dix on him. Now oh, throws the long on the perimeter. Man, a long man. Along the sideline to Litteris. Now to Lanier, eight to shoot. Lanier is going to get something going. He set, steps back and hits a three. Line drive to set shot three. And after Cricky fell down trying to work away his, his way around a screen. Back to a one-point Iowa lead. 26-25 with 9.18 to play. Cricky, shot fake, puts up the jump shot now, and it's short. North Florida shoots for the lead. Another rebound, one and done for the Hawkeyes. Nate Litteris, 6-6. Brad transfer with a rebound. Here comes a rebounder. Yeah. Lodgy Dembele will check in and throw his weight around. The Hawks need that. Between the legs dribble here for Jalen Smith, and a three is good. Back-to-back -back threes for the Ospreys. 9-0 run by North Florida. 28-26 Ospreys. And Smith just backed the dribble out. Nobody came with him, so he flipped it up there. 
Dick's trying to free up for a jump shot. No doing. Gets it inside to Cricky, and he's fouled hard by Dorian James. So Ben Cricky will get two free throws with 8.33 to play in the half. RG Dembele going to come into the game probably for Cricky, so we have to wait and hope Ben makes two. Hawk fans, well marked. Blue Cross Blue Shield knows you're here for every fadeaway, every alley oop, every buzzer beater. And Wellmark is here for every moment, too, with trusted health care coverage, committed to making health care better. Learn more at wellmark.com slash hoops. Josh Dix is out of the game in favor of Brock Hardy. Cricky makes the first free throw. He can tie the game with this. 28-27. Josiah Miles goes out. What a streak he had of five minutes there. Rebounding. Got an and one. Put back. Cricky makes both free throws, and Ben comes out of the game with four points all on free throws. And Laji Dembele, 6'8", 6'9", big kid, 240 pounds into the game. Eight and a half to go in the period. 28-28, all tied up, Iowa and North Florida. They gave LSU all the Tigers wanted last week. Here's Smith, center of the floor. He hit the big three a moment ago. Lanier, near corner, drives around Perkins. Gets up in the air, nowhere to go, and throws it away. Lanier out of control for a second straight trip down the floor. Harding races into the front court. Here's Perkins. Tony had the hot hand early for the Hawkeyes. Harding peering inside, gets it to Owen Freeman. Jump hook, good. And the Moline teammates hook it up. That's easy money right there. Owen Freeman, he has an advantage size-wise inside. Did a good job of keeping the defender on his back. Brock gave it to him. And a little jump hook for Owen. Hawks back in front by two. Here's a long three. No good by Smith. Cleared out of there by Patrick McCaffrey. Perkins with his head up. Looking now to a trailing McCaffrey. To Dembele. Cross court for Perkins. Shot fake to McCaffrey. Left of the circle. Patrick drives inside to Harding in the near corner. Brock weaves his way through heavy traffic. And what a great pass to Owen Freeman. And he lays it up and in. Harding did all the heavy lifting there. Freeman with the dessert. Six points for Owen Freeman off the bench. Two made free throws and then a couple of baskets right there. But you're right. Brock Harding made the play there. Just a perfect no-look pass to his buddy cutting on the baseline. Owen what Freeman. an assist. 32-28. Iowa scored six in a row. 6.58 to play in the half. Freeman with a poke away on the pass, and it's out of bounds to Iowa. Great job by Freeman as he beat. That was a lazy pass, really, and he beat Dorian James to the rainbow, knocked it off him out of bounds. Heck of a play by Owen Freeman. Great playmaking by both the Moline High School. Uh, energy. Former superstars. Off energy indeed. Price Sanford's going to bring some energy into the game, too, for Tony Perkins when we come back from a break. Iowa leading North Florida, 32-28. Back and forth we go. Hawks on a 6-0 run and now with the basketball. This is Hawkeye basketball presented by Wellmark Blue Cross Blue Shield from Learfield. This is John. Hey, my name is John Jackson. He's not some actor. He's a steward of the land with a John Deere 3 Series tractor and a PTO Quick Connect that hooks up rear implements with a single click. John runs with us because to him, there's nothing more important than connecting with the land. Nothing runs like a deer. Hear John's story at deer.com. Stop by your local John Deere dealer for a test drive today or learn more at deer.com. Your Iowa John Deere dealers, proud sponsors of Iowa basketball. Right now, new and current customers can get any phone for free at U.S. Cellular. So you can connect with all your family members this holiday season, like your snowbird grandparents, your adorable nieces, or your favorite uncle. Just think, with any phone free from U.S. Cellular, you can even call your aunt, who always makes you talk to your cousin, who's a dog. Or, you know, maybe just send her a festive text. Everyone can get the gift of connection at U.S. Cellular. Get any phone free today. U.S. Cellular, built for us. Terms apply. Visit uscellular.com for details. I'm Ingrid Lizarraga, breast surgeon at the University of Iowa Holden Comprehensive Cancer Center, the state's only NCI-designated cancer center. Here, we look beyond just the type of cancer you have to discover the molecular details of the disease. We have teams dedicated to each cancer type, with treatments and trials you won't find anywhere else in Iowa. Go to uihc.org cancer. 
Hawkeyes back in front, 32-28. Uh, We've had five lead changes, many of those coming in the last uh, five, six minutes. Uh, Bobby, it's been an arm wrestle here so far. Uh, Iowa, the much deeper team than North Florida, over 40 minutes. That, that may wear on the Ospreys. Got to believe uh, the Hawkeyes will do that. The Hawkeyes shooting great here to start the first half. 11 of 18, 61% on fire from deep. Four out of five, 80%. They haven't made one lately. Uh, they made three early in there and then another one. But uh, it's been the defense. I thought the defense stiffened up a little bit with the second unit that comes on with Freeman and Patrick's with this group, Brock Harding, Laji. Dembele. Brock Harding has been a spark off the bench uh, for the Hawkeyes. He's got beautiful assists. He's only played two minutes, but he's been running the show and found his buddy Owen Freeman inside for a go-ahead basket for the Hawkeyes a moment ago. Here's Patrick McCaffrey. Baseline jumper. He rattles it in. Patrick's jump shot much better look in the last couple games. Gets his feet underneath him. Yeah, if he squares up, he doesn't play off one foot. He's playing off two feet. He goes up straight and knocks the jumper down. Hawks are back up six. And here's another wild pass in the lane thrown away by the Ospreys. One went off the, uh, the limb of Josiah Miles. He's had a good game here in the first half, but a missile of a pass by Jake Vanderheiden. He wasn't waiting for it, and a turnover is the uh, sixth of the first half for North Florida. 6-12 to go. Iowa 34, North Florida 28. Dembele with a shot fake, drives inside. He's trying to throw it to the corner to Brock Harding, and Owen Freeman stuck that big left wing up there, picked it off, and laid it up and in. Stuck to his hand like a wide receiver with those receiver gloves on, and he just <laughs> snagged it and easily put it up eight points off the bench for Owen. Nice pass there, Lodgy. Here's a quick shot. Go get it. Uh, no good. Thrown up by Smith, the young point guard. Harding brings it back for the Hawkeyes, who are up eight. Bryce Sanford, shot fake, now let's fly. Good from 15 feet. Beautiful move by Price Sanford, and Matt Driscoll sensing an Iowa run, calls a quick timeout. His team is now down 10, 38-28, and it's been a 12-0 run, if my math is correct. It's been a three-and-a-half-minute drought for North Florida. Yeah, and it's been the defense's second unit has uh, stiffened up and getting the rebounds, the runouts, playing fast, and Owen Freeman, eight points during this 12-0 run, uh, along with a uh, basket there by Price Sanford. University of Iowa Healthcare has the game plan for your same-day health care needs. If you need treatment for a common illness or minor injury, visit one of several UI quick care or urgent care locations throughout the Iowa City Cedar Rapids corridor. Their care and expertise will help you get back in the game. UI Healthcare, a proud sponsor of your Iowa Hawkeyes. Let's see any lineup changes for the Hawks. Why, be, would, yeah. why would you? Why would you? Yeah, this, <laughs> this unit's playing with some energy. Everybody's playing well for the Hawks, really. Peyton Sanford has two fouls, so Brother Price is going to finish the half. Five and a half minutes to go. And again, another turnover. This one, another unforced error. Now, I say unforced, but that 1-2-2 two, has been effective. Yeah, it has. And uh, th these young kids play it. they got their arms out. They're, they're waving their arms. They're making it tough. Every time they've got it across half court, Gary, if not turning it over, it's been right at that 10-second uh, Yeah, mark. they've been really close to a couple 10-second shot clock uh, uh, midcourt violations. Hawks look to keep the pressure on and stretch the lead. Harding, quick pass to Freeman. Jump shot from the wing, no good. A little strong, and a strong rebound by Oscar Berry, who's back in the game. Here comes North Florida, up-tempo, shot inside, no good, but a foul called on Iowa. Ja NZ with a shot fake, got around uh, Lodgy Dembele, and Lodgy with a reach commits the personal. With 5-11 to go, Iowa 38, and North Florida 28. 5.38 to play in the first half. And uh, here is Jake Vanderheiden at the line. 50% free thrower. Knocks the first one down. That ends the 12-0 uh, Hawkeye run. One more coming in the lefty. Strokes two. 38-30. Iowa's lead is eight. Here's a drive inside. Ooh, a lot of contact. Patrick McCaffrey lost the ball on the way up. No foul, apparently, so we play on. Up tempo push into the front court by NZ. Ja NZ. Shot fake. Now a step back three by NZ, and he banked it in. I don't know what o more Owen Freeman could do there, yeah. but you'll take it. N uh, N NZ banks it off the window. 
38-33. Straight on bank, too. So that lead has been chopped in half. McCaffrey with a shot and heavy traffic, no good. Owen Freeman with a strong rebound up and in. Offensive board work by Owen Freeman. He is doing it all in the Iowa, and he's got 10 double figures already. Double figures already. How many rebounds does that young man have? Looks like uh, that was his first one, but he is battling inside. Made some great catches in heavy traffic. Here's a, oh, I thought it was a turnover on, good job by Dembele, poking that bounce pass along the sideline away from Vanderheiden. I thought Vanderheiden touched it, but no, sir. Off of uh, Dembele. 40-33, Iowa with a seven-point lead. And 4 minutes, 17 seconds to play in the first half. Side court out of bounds for the Ospreys. Here's Ja NZ. Thought about another three, but McCaffrey was in his way this time. And he takes the dribble along the sideline. Now lobs up a long jumper over Dembele. Not even close. Hawks clear. Run out. Here's a lob to Dembele in heavy traffic. Double team brought the ball down to his feet. And fortunately drew a hacking foul. They're going to get uh, Ja NZ with the reach and the hook. That's his second. Just under four minutes to go. First half time out on the floor with Iowa leading 40 to 33. Hawkeye basketball is sponsored by Wimmers at the game or at home. Wimmers premium quality hot dogs and sausages will score with family and friends. Take the highest quality beef and pork. Combine it with natural spices, and you get the best-tasting hot dog. Wimmer's the official hot dog of the Iowa Hawkeyes. With the score, Iowa 40, North Florida 33. We pause from Carver Hawkeye Arena and Mediacom Court. This is Hawkeye Basketball, presented by Wellmark Blue Cross Blue Shield from Learfield. Equity salutes today's hero of the game as a proud sponsor of the ongoing recognition of our military during Hawkeye games this season. Please join American Equity in thanking all who have served our country. American Equity is more than just retirement savings and income products. They are committed to providing you best-in-class service and high-quality retirement income that helps deliver the independence to dream and reach your goals. To learn more about American Equity, please visit their website at American-Equity.com. Our mission at Openall is to provide exceptional retirement living and health services through life care. I'm Steve Rowe, CEO. We are a not-for-profit life plan community and have served the Iowa City area for 57 years. Openall is located near University of Iowa Hospitals and Clinics, Kinnick Stadium, Carver Hawkeye Arena, Hancher Auditorium, and downtown Iowa City. Visit our website at openall.com to learn more. We're a proud sponsor of Hawkeye Athletics. Go Hawks! Hawk fans, be sure to visit and connect with these local business partners of the Iowa Hawkeyes, located in the Des Moines area. Car Law, Community Choice Credit Union, and Royal Flooring. Facing a criminal charge or complicated family law situation, Car Law Firm has the trial experts you need. As experienced trial attorneys, we understand how much is on the line. Go to carlawiowa.com for a free consultation. That's car with two R's, lawiowa.com. In the first half, 3.56 to go, Iowa 40, and the Ospreys of North Florida, 33. Rebounds are even, Bobby, at 12 apiece. Paint score is even at 14. Bench score, uh, bench uh, points even at 12. Uh, Iowa has four three-point goals, five for North Florida. Pretty even all over the chart. Yeah, haven't made a three, though, since Tony Perkins uh, splashed that one down. We could end the half here with a flurry of threes, maybe one by Brock Harding, one by Sanford. Iowa basketball. Here's a throw inside to Dembele. Nice entry pass by Freeman. Those two youngsters are on the same page. Five or six team fouls. Oh, it is a seventh, so it will be uh, the one and one. Foul on Miles. That's his second. And at the line is Laji Dembele for the one and bonus. Free throw's good. Now's your chance to make a difference, Hawk fans. Join the swarm and partner with Iowa men's basketball in serving charities in eastern Iowa. Learn more at iowaswarm.com. So important to the future of the Hawks with NIL here to stay. Second free throw is missed, and it's out of bounds. It'll stay with the Hawkeyes, though. Good effort inside. I uh, can't remember. It was a 
I think it was Owen Freeman. Yeah, Freeman or Price Sanford kept it alive. Here's Price. who passed up a three. Now to Harding. 14 to shoot for the Hawks. One of two free throws for Dembele, and the Hawks' lead is eight. Harding with a crossover dribble misses the jump shot. High post right, and the rebound tipped to the visitors from North Florida. Brock Harding, good-looking jump shot, just couldn't get it to go. Here's Lanier with a wild jump shot early in the shot clock. No good. Iowa with a rebound. McCaffrey all the way down, off the square and in. Nice pass by Price Sanford. Hit Patrick in stride in the lane, and he laid it up and in off the square with the left hand. He did. Nice job there. Under control, going to his left. Had to switch hands in midair, and Patrick now has seven. Hawks are back up ten, and a pass. Nice job, Price Sanford. Denied. A lazy wing pass. Sanford reached over his defender and deflected it right off Chaz Lanier, and that's nine, eight turnovers. Eight turnovers by North Florida. Iowa up 10, 43-33 with 3.03 to play here in the first half. Nice big run by the Hawks would be in order here. Go to the locker room. Here's a give and go. Nice play by Harding. Gets it inside to Owen Freeman. Jump shot. Oh, missed it. Right back after it, though. Put it up and in. Play and catch with himself and gets the score. He's just the biggest man on the court right there, towering over the smaller Ospreys, guys that are on the floor. Owen Freeman, what a first half for him. He's got 12. A dozen for Owen. Yeah, here's a nice drive around two defenders by Jalen Smith, just a freshman from Ocoee, Florida. And he gets two back, 45-35. Iowa's lead is 10. Biggest lead of the night has been at 12. 2.20 to go first half. 45-35. Bounce pass along the lane, right of the lane, for Dembele. Spins into the paint, now whirls back to the baseline and misses the fadeaway jump shot. Lanier is on his horse, quickly into the front court. A three is no good from deep in the right wing. Jalen Smith missing. Boy, they don't waste any time getting off shots. About eight seconds there. Patrick McCaffrey all the way. Misses the jumper on a drive to the basket. And a foul called on North Florida. I don't know if it was on the rebound or if Patrick's going to shoot free throws. First foul on Jalen Smith. Now it was on the rebound, so Price Sanford will shoot free throws. Price hasn't been to the foul line that often, 50%. Hawkeye basketball is sponsored again this season by Anheuser-Busch and Bud Light. Stay tuned for our halftime show, courtesy of Bud Light. Bud Light, proud sponsor of Hawkeye Athletics. Easy to drink, easy to enjoy. Bud Light. Price misses the front end of the one-on-one. Hawks are leaving some points out there late in the first half. Minute 50 to play. Till the intermission, Iowa 45. North Florida, 35. Smith, they go four in, one out. Smith around a screen. Can't get the ball to the screener, Vanderheiden. Here's a three good from the wing by Josiah Miles. Boy, As advertised. Yeah, it doesn't matter who. They'll throw it up from anywhere. Six points now from Miles. 45-38. Hawks can't shake the Ospreys, at least not yet. Here's Tricky back in the game to Tony Perkins. Couple of the starters back in. Tricky wants the ball. Bryce Sanford can't get it to him. So Tony Perkins takes it. Nice baseline bounce pass, but it got away from Tricky. Actually never reached him in a jump ball. Good defense. Good interior post defense by North Florida. 106 to play in the half. 45-38. Iowa's lead is seven as they mop up some perspiration on the floor. Stay with us for our halftime coverage. We'll Give you a scoreboard update. The ball stays with Iowa, but just five to shoot. Harding into the corner to Tony Perkins. Foul. Three, no good, but he's fouled. Knocked down. And a foul called, I think, on Jalen Smith. Yep, it is. How many is that on him? Oh, only two. I thought it might be his third, but he's got two quick ones here. 103 to go, 45-38, and Perkins a 72% foul shooter will get three free throws this one's good Tony had a hot start to the game trying to finish the half as hot makes the first he's got 13 and the second one crawls out of there he'll get one more Rock Harding gets a nice hand as he 
is replaced by Desante Bowen. Good job running the team right there by the freshman Brock Hardy. Tony gets two of three free throws. He's got 14 points, and the Hawks have a nine-point lead, 47-38. Lanier, double team, far sideline. Rifles a one-arm pass into the far corner, and Dembele got underneath Vanderheiden when he went up for the for the catch. And 16 fouls on Iowa. Second on Dembele. So Josh Dix will come and get uh, Lodgy. Provided some quality minutes out there, but he's going to have to sit. 6'8 freshman from St. Benedict's Prep. Underneath, out of bounds for the Ospreys. They lob it to Vanderheiden in the lane. Now to Lanier. Big high bounce dribble. Now bounces at left wing for Darian James. Back out front for Smith. He drives inside. Leaves it into the corner for Miles. Now a jump shot from the wing is good again. My goodness. Vanderheiden with Cricky all over him and still hit the shot. Six point game with 26 seconds to go in the first half. Iowa 47 and North Florida 41. You could take it all the way down pretty much to the end of the half here. There's three seconds different or two seconds different between shot clock and game clock. Seven first half threes. Seven for North Florida. Bowen forces a jump shot. No good with eight Early. seconds to play in the half. That's not going to make Fran happy. Racing into the front court is Smith. Here's a three. No good. Kicks to the wing. Jump shot is good at the buzzer by Josiah Miles. Fran McCaffrey getting after Desante Bowen. He's got a four-point game at halftime. A three and a two in the last 30 seconds thrown in by the Ospreys. Always looking to shoot early in the clock, and they have. And trail it now by only four after the Hawks led by as many as 10, actually 12, in the first half. And we still got 20 minutes to go, 47-43 Iowa. Stay tuned for our first half recap on the Bud Light Halftime Show. This is Hawkeye Basketball from Learfield. Right now, new and current customers can get any phone for free at U.S. Cellular. So you can connect with all your family members this holiday season, like your snowbird grandparents, your adorable nieces, or your favorite uncle. Just think, with any phone free from U.S. Cellular, you can even call your aunt, who always makes you talk to your cousin, who's a dog. Or, you know, maybe just send her a festive text. Everyone can get the gift of connection at U.S. Cellular. Get any phone free today. U.S. Cellular, built for us. Terms apply. Visit uscellular.com for details. How do you become America's best-selling brand? Let's break it down. Innovative tech means smarter and safer driving. Intelligent all-wheel drive will keep you ready for anything. And built Ford Tough Trucks will always get the job done. Plus, come into your local Ford store today and get super low APR financing, big cash back, and great lease offers on Ford's full line of cars, trucks, and SUVs. That's Ford, and that's how you become America's best-selling brand. Sales claim based on calendar year sales. When the game goes into overtime. But... The game goes into overtime. The choice to enjoy is easy. Bud Light. Easy to drink. Easy to enjoy. Order Bud Light online today. Enjoy responsibly. Anheuser-Busch Bud Light Beer, St. Louis, Missouri. If you've got the right tools and the friendly people at U.S. Bank in your corner, making smarter money choices is a piece of cake. If only our tools and helpful advisors could have helped you avoid some of those not-so-smart choices in life. Like that time you tried to pick up unicycling. Oh, coming through! Or when you thought it'd be okay to pet that squirrel in the park. Good squirrel. Good squirrel. <laughs> While we can't help you with all that, we can help you bank smartly at usbank.com slash smarter together. Member FDIC. This has been the Wellmark Blue Cross and Blue Shield first half on the Hawkeye Sports Network. This is the Bud Light Halftime Show. Bud Light, easy to drink, easy to enjoy. Hawkeyes go empty from the field in the final 250 of the first half. Made a couple free throws, but their double-digit lead is now four at halftime as uh, North Florida scored the last five of the period. 
Bobby Hansen on a on a three and a short jumper from the left wing. And it's 47-43, Hawkeyes at the break. Uh, saw a lot of good, but some foul issues for Peyton Sanford. A couple of other Hawkeyes. Lodgy Dembele picked up his second late. And North Florida doing what they do. They're going to they're gonna throw up threes seven for 16 in the first half. Yeah, that, as advertised, Gary, if you, it, you know anybody that paid attention to it or listened to Coach McCaffrey's pregame talk, it's, that's the key to the game right there, their three-point shooting. I mean, they average about 11 three-point to field goals made per game. I mean, they shoot half their shots are from threes, but Hawks were up on them on a couple of them. Mullen Freeman, I know, got uh, it got a tough one there where the guy banked it in on him, but, you know, I got some good minutes, positive minutes with the guys off the bench. Mullen Freeman, Brock Harding, Laje in there with uh, Josh Dix, Patrick McCaffrey Jeffrey was with that group a little bit. The 1-2-2 two, two was effective, too, the three-quarter court pressure. But tough finish for the Hawkeyes to the half. A couple of three-pointers made. But, and then uh, DeSante Bowen with a quick shot allowed him to get the ball back and knocked one down there to give him, uh, the Hawkeyes just a four-point lead, 47-43. Uh, work to be done against this uh, solid North Florida team out of the Atlantic Sun. We'll review the halftime stat sheet in a minute. Let's look at the Latham Seeds charity stripe recap. Hawks won the uh, back. Battle at the free throw line, that hit it, hitting 9 of 12 in the first period. North Florida was 4 out of 6, so the Hawks with 5 more free throws. And that's our charity stripe recap, courtesy of Latham High Tech Seeds. You know, the Hawkeyes have a diverse combination of talent, and at Latham High Tech Seeds, you'll find the most diverse portfolio in the industry. Diversify for success at LathamSeeds.com. LathamSeeds.com. Our halftime coverage is sponsored by Bud Light. Bud Light, proud sponsor of Iowa Hawkeye Athletics. Easy to drink, easy to enjoy. 47-43, Hawkeyes at the break. We'll come back and look at the shooting numbers when we return. This is Hawkeye Basketball from Lurfield. Flooring has everything for your home from the floors up. Did you know we also feature appliances, custom cabinetry to update your kitchens, bathrooms, and more? Yep, we're more than just flooring. Shop Royal Flooring today. Right now, new and current customers can get any phone for free at U.S. Cellular. So you can connect with all your family members this holiday season, like your snowbird grandparents, your adorable nieces, or your favorite uncle. Just think, with any phone free from U.S. Cellular, you can even call your aunt who always makes you talk to your cousin, who's a dog. Or, you know, maybe just send her a festive text. Everyone can get the gift of connection at U.S. Cellular. Get any phone free today. U.S. Cellular, built for us. Terms apply. Visit uscellular.com for details. If you've got the right tools and the friendly people at U.S. Bank in your corner, making smarter money choices is a piece of cake. If only our tools and helpful advisors could have helped you avoid some of those not-so-smart choices in life. Like that time you tried to pick up unicycling. Whoa, whoa, whoa coming through! Or when you thought it'd be okay to pet that squirrel in the park. Good squirrel. Good squirrel. <laughs> While we can't help you with all that, we can help you bank smartly at usbank.com slash smarter together. Member FDIC. Does your company attire make you feel like you're always fourth and long? It's time for a change. Hand the ball off to Authentic Brand and watch your team transform into MVPs. On game days, our team dresses like champions in Authentic Brand. Ensure that your company's reputation remains untarnished by using nothing but the label specifically designed to display your company's identity. Ask your supplier for Authentic Brand products and see for yourself why it's more than just a label. It's a statement. Are your car payments baking you crazy? Bring home the bacon. When you move your car loan to Community Choice and get up to three months of no car payments, your bacon called, it's ready to go home. Bring home the bacon at unbankyourbacon.com. Loan subject to credit approval and analysis. See credit union for details. This copyrighted broadcast is an exclusive presentation of Learfield under the broadcasting rights granted by the University of Iowa. Reuse of this presentation is prohibited without the expressed written consent of the university and Learfield. Announcers are provided by Learfield and approved by the university. Halftime Iowa leading North Florida 47-43. Let's pause 10 seconds for station identification. College basketball from Iowa City. You're listening to Hawkeye Basketball. (laughs) 
Hawks have you covered from uh, east to west in Omaha. Listen to Iowa basketball on KXCB 1420 AM and 106.5 FM in Iowa City, right here in Iowa City, AM 800 KXIC. Out in Prairie du Chien, Wisconsin, WPRE, AM and FM. In Red Oak, Southwest Iowa, KCSI and KOAK, AM and FM. In Harlan, hi to the folks listening in on KNOD 105.3 FM. And in Dubuque, it's WDBQ 107.5 on the dial. Thank you, one and all. First half, Hawks up four. Iowa hit 17 of 31 from the field. Four of five from three and nine of 12 from the foul line. For North Florida, 16 of 33. That's 48.5%. Iowa shot 55%. 16 of 33 for the Ospreys. Seven three-point goals in 16 attempts and four of six from the foul line. Rebounds were even at 17 apiece. Hawks turned the ball over just four times in the first half to eight for North Florida. Iowa's leading scorer, Tony Perkins, with 14. 12 for Owen Freeman off the bench. Seven points, four rebounds for Patrick McCaffrey. For North Florida, one double-figure scorer. That's their leading scorer on the year, Chaz Lanier. He's hit all five of his jump shots, including a three. Has 11 points, but has turned it over five times. So the Hawks will continue to put pressure on him. Five lead changes, one tie. Right now, the Hawkeyes have the lead at 47-43 at the break. Our halftime stats, as always, sponsored by hy Score big savings with the all-new, totally free hy Perks membership. This is Hawkeye Basketball from Learfield. If you've got the right tools and the friendly people at U.S. Bank in your corner, making smarter money choices is a piece of cake. If only our tools and helpful advisors could have helped you avoid some of those not-so-smart choices in life. Like that time you tried to pick up unicycling. Oh, oh, coming through! Or when you thought it'd be okay to pet that squirrel in the park. Good squirrel. Good squirrel. <laughs> While we can't help you with all that, we can help you bank smartly at usbank.com slash smarter together. Member FDIC. When the game goes into overtime. But... The game goes into overtime. The choice to enjoy is easy. Bud Light. Easy to drink. Easy to enjoy. Order Bud Light online today. Enjoy responsibly. Anheuser-Busch Bud Light Beer, St. Louis, Missouri. Soon we'll go from pool back to school. The end of summer is a total bummer. But yesterday I went shopping and got all the essentials. New backpack, new kicks. Oh, and this is huge. Mom finally got rid of our basic internet and switched us to Extreme. The new Wi-Fi is amazing. Go back to school with best and fast internet from Extreme. Get speeds from 100 meg up to 1 gig and Wi-Fi 360 Pro with advanced toll home coverage. Call 844-4FASTER or shop online at Extreme.com. When it comes to your health, you need the full picture. That means the right diagnosis and the right treatment right from the start. I'm Aaron Bose, pediatric neurologist with University of Iowa Healthcare. Here, we're working together every day to advance medicine so you can get the best care. With more research, more clinical trials, and more treatment options than anywhere else in the state, the University of Iowa Healthcare is changing medicine and changing lives. Learn more at uihc.org. Before we go to the second half, here's a look at uh, a U.S. Bank scoreboard update. Drake over Valparaiso tonight, 83-65. Bulldogs with a win. It was Northern Iowa falling at home to Belmont. Belmont with another good program, 90-70. Ohio State beat Central Michigan, 88-61. Virginia knocked off 14th-ranked Texas A&M, 59-47. 17th-ranked North Carolina held off number 10, Tennessee, 100-92. to James Madison beat Buffalo by 15. And St. Joe's upset Villanova, 78-65. All right, here are the all-Big Ten Iowa Hawkeyes uh, announced yesterday and today. On offense, Logan Jones, Connor Colby, Nick DeYoung, tight end Eric All, Rusty Feth. Offensive lineman, tackle Jennings Dunker, 
LaShawn, uh, LeSean Williams at running back. Defensively, Cooper DeGene was named the Tatum Woodson Big Ten Defensive Back of the Year. And likewise, he was the Big Ten's return specialist of the year, named after Edelman and Fields. All Big Ten defense first team, linebacker Jay Higgins, defensive back Cooper DeGene, punter Torrey Taylor. Cooper DeGene uh, bo- named to both the coaches and the media. Sebastian Castro, second team. Third team, Joe Evans, Nick Jackson, and place kicker Drew Stevens. Honorable mention, Y.A. Black, Deontay Craig, Logan Lee, Quinn Schulte, all all Big Ten. Congratulations, Hawkeyes. That's the U.S. Bank scoreboard. This is Hawkeye basketball from Learfield. The Burger Shed is a burger lover's dream come true. Our handcrafted burgers are made with a signature blend of certified Angus beef and smoky brisket, served with house-made pickles. But if you're looking for something other than a burger, don't you worry. We've got that, too. Check out our wide variety of shed sandwiches, salads, and real ice cream shakes. Burgers, beers, and a bunch of BS. Burger Shed, Bass Pro Drive in Altoona. Our mission at Open All is to provide exceptional retirement living and health services through life care. I'm Steve Rowe, CEO. We are a not-for-profit life plan community and have served the Iowa City area for 57 years. Oaknell is located near University of Iowa Hospitals and Clinics, Kinnick Stadium, Carver Hawkeye Arena, Hancher Auditorium, and downtown Iowa City. Visit our website at oaknell.com to learn more. We're a proud sponsor of Hawkeye Athletics. Go Hawks! If you or someone you know is having thoughts of suicide, experiencing a mental health or substance use crisis, or just need someone to listen, 988 provides a direct connection to free, confidential, and compassionate support. When you call, text, or chat 988, you'll be quickly connected to trained crisis counselors who will listen to your concerns, provide support, and connect you to additional resources if needed. There is hope. You are not alone. For 24-7 support, call or text 988 or chat 988lifeline.org. Hawk fans, be sure to visit and connect with these local business partners of the Iowa Hawkeyes. Located in the Des Moines area, Car Law, Community Choice Credit Union, and Royal Flooring. Are your car payments baking you crazy? Bring home the bacon when you move your car loan to Community Choice and get up to three months of no car payments. Your bacon called. It's ready to go home. Bring home the bacon at unbankyourbacon.com. Loan subject to credit approval and analysis. See Credit Union for details. Go to the second half. Uh, Iowa leading by four over North Florida. Bobby Hansen's up the tunnel with Hawkeye assistant coach Courtney Eldridge. He's sponsored by your John Deere dealers, including Bowden Steiner Implement in Dyersville. Courtney has advertised these guys come out here and shooting threes uh, pretty much uh, half their shots. And what you know, end of the first half kind of got away from me a little bit. What'd you see? Yeah, Bob, I, I know we talked about it for three days. Uh, you know, they averaged 30 uh, three point attempts a game. They're halfway there, you know what I mean? They got 16, and we got to be in our space. They, they put five guys out there that can make them. And, uh, you know, I don't think our guys are accustomed, the big guys anyway, are accustomed to guarding uh, uh, post guys that can shoot it like that. We got to be, we got to do a better job being in their space in the second half. And what was your message uh, to the team there? Play inspired, man. You know, we got some guys going through some personal things. And, you know, we, we are inspirational to a lot of people. And we got to find our why and go out there and play inspired basketball. That was my message. Okay, thanks, Coach. And Patrick McCaffrey drives down the middle of the lane, starts the second half with a dunk for the Hawkeyes after a, a turnover on uh, North Florida. 49-43. Iowa jumps back into a six-point lead to start the second half. Patrick having, having a good, uh, solid basketball game. Shot fake and a nice bounce pass inside and an easy layup by North Florida's Dorian James. Great feed after the shot fake by Oscar Berry. 49-45. Courtney Eldridge with Bobby Hanson, courtesy of your Iowa John Deere dealers. Proud sponsor of Hawkeye basketball. Ben Cricky just got called for a charge. The guy was moving. I mean, he was moving with him. He was underneath him. New charge block rules college basketball. You have to be set and sitting there waiting for a guy to come in. Yeah, that was a, a brutal call. Tough call there. Yeah. I mean, Cricky was putting the ball on the floor and driving to the basket. The guy's underneath him moving. 
and they both stumbled to the floor, and I think the official understands that uh, he missed that one. We'll look for a makeup call. Bottom line is it's 49-45 Iowa, but North Florida has the ball. Good defense on the perimeter by the Hawkeyes. North Florida looking inside. Here's Chaz Lanier with seven to shoot. Step back three is good. I mean, there's nothing you can do about that. Good defense. One point game. Iowa up 149. Now Patrick McCaffrey stumbles to the floor trying to turn the corner and turns it over. And here comes North Florida back with a chance to shoot and take the lead with a make. Hawks start the second half with Bowen and Perkins in the guard court. Cricky, Peyton Sanford, and he's going to look to get his game going. He had two fouls, missed half the first half. Just two points, one basket. Sanford and Patrick McCaffrey inside. We look at him, it's, you know, 18 to 20 points a game easily. Two minutes gone, second half. Dribbling exhibition by Moss goes down the right side of the lane, hits the jump shot. Up over Desadi Bowen. Iowa is trailing for the first time in a while. 50 49. Here's Peyton Sanford for three. He missed off the right of the iron and cleared. Strong rebound by Quick Shot by Lanier. 17 38 to play. 50 49. Iowa down one, needing a stop. Outscored 6-2 to two to start the second half. Here's a three, no good. Long three put up there by Vanderheide and Patrick. Pemack with a long, re- a strong rebound into the front court himself. Leaves it for Sanford. Now to Cricky. Spin move, high post right. Leaves it for a trailing Tony Perkins. Pop-up jumper, good. Iowa back in front, 51-50. Put your need out of your senior leader right there, Tony Perkins, 16 points to lead the Hawks. Just when you needed a field goal, Tony found a way. Get to the free throw line area, 15 feet away. 17-04 to play in the game. Iowa back in front, 51-50. Here's a catch baseline left. And a drive inside by James. Turn, shoots, and scores in the lane. They can't miss. Ben Cricky off. Right in his face, but McCaffrey for three. Yes. James was admiring the jump shot he hit at the other end and forgot where his man is. And Patrick strokes a three. 54-52 Iowa after that exchange of baskets. Now you got to D up and extend this lead. Moss throws on point to Vanderheiden. Now to Oscar Berry. Keep an eye on him. He can shoot the three. Here's James chased out on the wing by Cricky. Here's a drive and a missed jump shot. Left of the lane by Dorian James. Good defense by DeSante Bowen. Hawks are running the other way. Tony Perkins inside. Hits the shot and a foul call. The and one coming for a percolating Perkins right now. Hawks go back up four in the blink of an eye and a chance to get to five. Doing it with defense. Getting the rebounds. Steal. Run out. Tony Perkins. Leadership. Finding a way to score. And the end one coming for Tony. He's got 18. Matt Driscoll giving it to Jake Vanderheiden. As Perkins gets the and one. Tony having a good night. Got 18 points. Free throw takes flight. And it's right through. Now get down. And See him, him up. Iowa down one a moment ago at 51-50, or 52-51, has scored six in a row. And up five. Ooh, a near turnover on the sideline. Moss has it into the opposite corner. A three is no good. Peyton can't collar the rebound. It was scraped away from him, out of bounds. Last touch by Chaz Lanier. Man, can he get up. Lanier at 6-4, really skies. But a good block out by Peyton. He had his hands on mitts on the ball. Scraped away. Good posture. And it's Iowa basketball when we come back. 15-46 to play in the game. Iowa 57. And the Ospreys of North Florida 52. This is Hawkeye basketball. Presented by Wellmark Blue Cross Blue Shield from Learfield. Criminal charge or complicated family law situation? Our law firm has the trial experts you need. As experienced trial attorneys, we understand how much is on the line. Go to carlawiowa.com for a free consultation. That's car with two R's, lawiowa.com. Everyone knows the BBB is the Better Business Bureau, but depending on what you need, it's the Better Plumber Bureau, the Better Auto Mechanic Bureau, the Better Accountant Bureau. That's because the BBB connects people with businesses they can trust. So think of the BBB as the better check that business out first so you don't get ripped off bureau. Be smart. 
Always look for the BBB seal because it's looking out for you. Find a better business anytime at BBB.org. Treat yourself to one of our award-winning entrees at the Machine Shed. Come get your hands around one of our famous pork tenderloins, our most popular sandwich. Serve either deep-fried golden brown or unbreaded and grilled. Or try our roasted, stuffed Iowa chop that is stuffed with a warm apple raisin dressing and glazed with an apple whiskey sauce. Trust me, you won't regret it. This is Jeff Grunder, and we can't wait to have you over for dinner at the Machine Shed. I-80 in Hickman Road, Urbandale, and I-80 in Northwest Boulevard, Davenport. Royal Flooring has everything for your home from the floors up. Did you know we also feature appliances, custom cabinetry to update your kitchens, bathrooms, and more? Yep, we're more than just flooring. Shop Royal Flooring today. Hawkeyes have roared back after building a double-digit lead in the first half and leading by four at the break. A hot start to the second half. 6-2 run by North Florida gave the Ospreys the lead, but then a Patrick McCaffrey three from deep in the left wing. And an and one, a conventional three by Tony Perkins after a stop. 6-0 lightning fashion run by the Hawkeyes are back up five. And now Peyton Sanford with a rebound as a fresh possession for the Hawkeyes. Yeah, and the Hawks are starting to get, get going again here a little bit, and Fran got after him during that timeout a little bit, so see what they drew, drew up here. I'd like to see get the ball inside to Ben Cricky in there and let him go to work, see if we can get him going offensively. Bowen and Peyton, Perkins, McCaffrey, and Cricky. No changes in the Iowa lineup for the moment. There's a bounce feed left of the circle for Tony Perkins from DeSante, and Tony stumbled. Looked like he was thought, saw an open man, then when he didn't, he double clutched, picked the ball up, and walked with it. Look for the roll man, Ben Cricky, right there, who set the screen at the top of the key. He rolled, had his man on his back, and Tony just couldn't pull the trigger. Looked like he caught an edge of that sneaker. Yeah, he stubbed his toe, as they say. Seven turnovers for Iowa. And the Hawks give it right back. Need to play some more defense. Sanford covering up on Nate Litteris. He can shoot the three, too. Now, a between the legs dribble lost by Moss, but he runs it down near the timeline. Seven to shoot. Gets around Bowen and lays it up and in off the square. Sonny just could not keep up with him. 57-54. Almost had a turnover. End up giving up a basket. Hawks by three. 14-55 to play in the game. McCaffrey skip pass left of the lane to Cricky. Shot fake. Ben... Backs it in on Dorian James. Holds up left of the lane to Bowen. Desanti thought about a three. Now looks inside. Here's Perkins. Gets it to Cricky. Whirls inside. Jump good. Hook up and good. Nothing Lanier can do about that at 6-4. Now that's what you need to do is utilize a big man. He knows where the basket is. He can score six points. Ben Cricky. 59-54. Iowa really pushes that man-to-man -man out now on the perimeter. So much so that Moss is standing on Herky's comb at the moment. Right side for Lanier. He's looking for his shot. Perkins gets him on the handoff. Gets the shot away again. And anyway, misses. Tip no good. Rebounded by, strong rebound by Peyton Sanford. Iowa's leading rebounder flexing his muscles right now. McCaffrey, hard penetration in the lane. Shot up no good. Put back attempt no good. Rebounded by Cricky. Up and good. That's a way to work over that offensive glass physical basketball inside referees letting the kids play ben cricky used his body and shielded off the defender and gets another basket 61 54 iowa shoots back in front by seven cricky with a kick and an attempted bounce pass by moss will give the ball back to the ospreys with shot clock resetting to 20. vander hyden at 6 8 225 he brings a little more bulk in there for North Florida, and he enters along with uh, let's see who came back in. Okay, I got it now. It's Josiah Miles. Here's Vander Heiden on the wing to Lanier. Left-handed shovel pass, far wing. Now a jump shot by Miles. No good. Another weak side board by Peyton Sanford. He's picking up some numbers now. Peyton all the way himself. Drops into the lane. Shot up and good with a left hand, no less. Nice. He's just surveying. Nobody stopped the basketball. He got all the way inside the paint, was looking over to Cricky, but saw it open up on that left side and softly put it up there on the rim with the left. Iowa back in front by nine. Another 6-0 run here in the last minute 15 for the Hawkeyes. 
13.05 to play in the game. Here's a step back three. Good by North Florida's Jalen Smith. Peyton backed off him. He stepped back, and the lefty, a freshman from Okia, Florida, drops down a tray. Bowen drives into traffic, drove into a double team, picked up the foul. He'll shoot two free throws. I like the way Iowa's them. driving the basketball right yeah, now. Yeah, absolutely. you got to attack. This team, you know, they've been running guys in and out of there. Their bench isn't real real strong, but Hawkeyes should have an advantage right there to Sante Bowen doing the right thing and pressing it. Nine threes for North Florida brings him back to within 63-57, but Bowen, excellent free throw shooter. We'll have a pair. First one's good for DeSante. Join the Iowa Lottery VIP Club and enter to win game day tickets to see Iowa men's basketball with the countdown to Carver promotion. Play Hawkeye Gold Scratch tickets today. Owen Freeman, who had a great first half, checks in. Josh Dix will come and get Bowen. Patrick McCaffrey is out of the lineup. Well-deserved breather. Patrick with a dunk and a three-point goal to start the second half. 12.49 to go. Bowen makes both free throws. 65-57. Iowa's lead is eight. DeSante now with seven. And the Iowa five is Perkins and Dix, Cricky, Freeman, and Peyton Sanford. Peyton's going to log some heavy minutes this second half. He missed ten minutes of the first half with foul issues. And here's a shoving foul from behind on Ben Cricky. Pass caught along the uh, sideline in front of the North Florida bench by Nate Litteris, and he was off balance. He might have fallen out of bounds, and Cricky tried to help him, and the official picked it up. Two team fouls on each club in the first uh, seven minutes plus of this second half. 12.33 to go. Iowa's playing better defense. They need more of that. Circle dribble to the wing. Here's Litteris, or Oscar, uh, or Vanderheiden, excuse me. They swung it around at a long three up and no good by Litteris. Kicks long, but run down by Peyton Sanford. Another rebound by Peyton. He got six quickly into the front court. Owen Freeman, a spin move, drives into heavy traffic along the baseline. Now throws to the corner, and a three is missed by Josh Dix. Rebounded by Jake Vander Heiden. North Florida running the other way, shooting shot block. Tony Perkins or Freeman got a piece of that one. On, on a three-point try. Perkins for three the other way. No good. And rebounded by Nate Litteris of North Florida. They're running. Bad pass in traffic by NZ. Picked off by Peyton Sanford. His three. Yes, Knocks sir. It Knocks it down. Peyton Sanford falls down and gets up screaming at the official. He Kelly Piper. Yeah. But no call. But it is a three for Peyton. 68-57. The Hawks go back up Double digits. Lead it by 11, 11 22 to play. What a stretch we've had here. Stop and go move down the right side of the lane. Jump shot no good by Miles. And then it, a putback is good. I didn't catch who got that. Vander. Vander Hyden. Yeah, and here's a layup by Cricky. He got Trying 10. To get caught up in the stats, and the Hawks throw it over the entire press in two throws. And Cricky with the lay in. 11 02 to go in the game. Timeout asked for by North Florida's Matt Driscoll. It's 70-59 Iowa. Let's all step out and catch our breath here. Hawks by 11 with 11 minutes to play in the game. Fans, here's a lineup ready to throw it down. Honda, HRV, CRV, Passport, and Pilot. They're ready to pounce this winter. See your Central Midwest Honda dealer. Great Honda dealers like Billion Honda right here in Iowa City. Say hi to Frank Giuliano, Levi Walker, and Tyler Walker. They handle the show on those beautiful new 2024 Hondas coming out. Your Honda dealers, including Billion Honda in Iowa City. This is Hawkeye Basketball presented by Wellmark Blue Cross Blue Shield from Learfield. Bananas are only 39 cents a pound at High V. That's not a sale price. That's the price with the High V Perks membership. And 39 cents a pound is not just the price today or this week, it's the Perks price every day. With the High V Perks membership, you can save on hundreds of products store wide every time you shop and count on Perks prices to stay the same. So if you want to pay less for bananas every day, sign up for High V Perks. It's free and easy. Some restrictions apply. 
Right now, you are not in the crowded Carver Hawkeye Arena, but you could be. You're not cheering a Hawkeye steal, fast break, and slam dunk, but you could be. Play the Hawkeye Gold Scratch Ticket, and you could win a VIP game day experience to see the Iowa men's basketball team. The countdown to Carver promotion from the Iowa Lottery lets you be a part of the action. To enter your ticket and see details, visit IALottery.com slash VIP. Your husband is pretty handy to have around. He makes the world's best mac and cheese. Lunch is ready. He's in the Tickle Monster Hall of Fame. (laughs) And he can teach anyone how to throw strikes. But a busted pipe and a basement full of water? Honey, I think we need a plumber. Is a little out of his league. That's where a homeowner's policy from Shelter Insurance comes in handy. We'll help get your house back in order and your husband back to what he does best. (laughs) Find an agent at shelterinsurance.com. We're your shield. We're your shelter. Hawkeye basketball leading here at home against North Florida, 70-59 with the 11-02 to play in the game. Gary Dolphin with Bobby Hansman back at uh, the parquet of Carver Hawkeye Arena and Mediacom Court. Corey Sheets, our engineer producer. End-to-end action. And it's not over yet. The Hawks having trouble putting away this Atlantic Sun team uh, because of nine three-point goals by North Florida. North Florida basketball, and they throw it away. Nice tip away by, I believe, Cricky. Tony Perkins ran and got the loose ball. Another turnover. That's 13 on North Florida. Cricky misses the jump shot. High post left. And rebounded by Chaz Lanier, the gifted Chaz Lanier, their best player, one of the best players in the league. He turns the corner on Peyton Sanford and scores on a driving layup. They spread the floor that time, and... Hard to keep up and battle uh, Lanier one on one. He tough. is 16 points. Cricky's tough inside. He draws a foul. That'll bring us to another official's timeout. Jake Vanderheiden is uh, called for the personal. And that's three on Big Jake. Timeout on the floor. 10:30 to play in the ball game. Iowa's lead is 11. Hawkeyes were down early. Had a 12-0 run. Took the lead. Only to have North Florida score six straight to start the second half. Got back in front. Then Patrick McCaffrey's three gave Iowa the lead back at 54-52. Tony Perkins with an and one put Iowa back up by five. And the Hawks have been able to stretch it to the present nine-point lead at 70-61 with the midway point of the second half. The exciting moments, the proud moments, even the hard moments. Well-marked Blue Cross Blue Shield is here for it all as your health care champion, making health care more affordable with more choices for care and peace of mind. No matter what comes your way, we're here for you. Find the right plan at wellmark.com slash hoops. This is Hawkeye Basketball presented by Wellmark Blue Cross Blue Shield from Learfield. Travel Leaders Destinations Unlimited. We provide experiential travel and vacation planning for Hawkeye fans across the state. Contact one of our destination experts to start planning your next trip at duagency.com. Hawk fans, be sure to visit and connect with these local business partners of the Iowa Hawkeyes. Located in the Des Moines area, Car Law, Community Choice Credit Union, and Royal Flooring. Royal Flooring has everything you and your home needs from the floors up. We proudly serve Des Moines area homes as your local one-stop shop for flooring, tile appliances, cabinetry, countertops, and more. Visit shoproyalflooring.com to give your home the royal treatment today. Do you trust your insurance agent? Do you trust your insurance company? Well, you'd better. Because all they've really sold you is a promise. A promise to be there when things go bad. To step up and put everything back the way it was. So, if you don't trust your insurance company, maybe it's time to find one you do trust. West Bend. The worst brings out our best. Visit thesilverlining.com to find out more. Are your car payments baking you crazy? Bring home the bacon when you move your car loan to Community Choice and get up to three months of no car payments. Your bacon called? It's ready to go home. Bring home the bacon at unbankyourbacon.com. Loans subject to credit approval and analysis. See credit union for details.
Hawkeyes with the lead, 70-61. Welcome back to our coverage of college basketball from Iowa City. Hawkeye wrestling. Iowa won six of the ten matches at Iowa State on Sunday. Hawks stay on the road uh, visiting Penn this weekend as uh, on Saturday. Gabe Arnold was named Big Ten Wrestler of the Week, the freshman from uh, Iowa City High. What a great match. He had. What a great effort he put forth uh, on Sunday afternoon at uh, Hilton Coliseum. Ben Cricky foul as we went to break, makes the first free throw. That's a 6 o'clock match Friday. I said Saturday. My, my bad. December 1st. Coming up uh, in a couple days. Hawkeye women host Bowling Green here at Carver Hawkeye Arena this weekend, Saturday afternoon. Cricky makes both free throws. Iowa up 11. Here comes a 10-second violation. They've been getting, they've been yeah, really they, close about six times. They've been pressing their luck all night long in the 1 2 2. Nothing else. It slows them down, forces them to burn time. That time uh, they got burned by a turnover. Yeah, Iowa doesn't look to, to get a lot of turnovers, but they do want to take time off so you don't have to defend so much in, this, in the uh, half court. That's a dozen turnovers on the Ospreys. Box up 11. Chance to stretch it out even more. 10 10 to play. Tony Perkins is tied up, gets it to a cutting Cricky layup, no good. Tip dunk is good by Owen Freeman. Boy, this kid has got great timing, great anticipation. 14 points for Owen. He's a double-digit scorer once again. He just keeps getting better and better with minutes on the floor. Here's a pass inside, a jump hook he is no good. Took a lap around the rim and came out. And here come the Hawks running, running, running. Missed jump shot that time by... Dorian James and another foul is called. Five team fouls. It seems like James has gotten a foul after every missed shot tonight. He, Owens he's hanging his head. Down low. He's frustrated. Yeah. Tough guard there, Owen Freeman is. He's got five, six inches on him. He does. Cricky with a shot fake draws the foul on the and one. Oh, what a beautiful up and under move. Uh, you know, Cricky, he's, he reminds me of Garza a little bit with that shot fake and up and under move. He's, he's crafty that way. Yeah, he's got good footwork down low, too, just like Luca had, and nice soft touch around the rim. Hawks are starting to wear down the Ospreys. They're grabbing at their shorts. Iowa, much deeper team, and Cricky is, he can sense it. And they're going for the throat right now. The and one goes, then with 15 points. Iowa's lead is 77-61. Now another near steal in the backcourt and another 10-second violation. Back to back. 9.30 to go in the game. Boy, nothing wears you out more mentally than back-to-back 10-second -back calls. Uh, and they're obviously wearing down physically. It's the size of the Hawkeyes got out there. Peyton Sanford, he's long out there. Tony Perkins is active. Josh Dix, your best Freeman. perimeter defender. And then you got Freeman and Cricky on that backside. And Perkins is just a physical brute. He really gets after you and pounds on you. A three is good by Peyton Sanford. Put the ball inbounds, dribble it to the center of the floor, and from the top of the circle, drills a tray. For him, back-to-back -back threes. He's got ten points. After missing most of the first half. Here's a three from the wing. Good. By Jalen Smith. That is ten threes for North Florida. They're averaging ten and a half. Peyton Sanford rushed that three early in the shot clock. Nine minutes to play in the game. Iowa's lead is 16. It had been 19. Here's a drive and a score off glass again. Taking the attack to uh, Cricky is Nate Litteris. So five quick points for North Florida. It's 80-66, Hawkeyes. This team can come back in a hurry. They proved that in the first half. Here's a near steal. Now it is stolen away. Up, nope. got out of bounds. Dribble poke away on Peyton Sanford. A great effort by Jalen Smith. But it'll stay with Iowa. Peyton Sanford comes out of the game. Laji Dembele replaces him. Brock Harding comes and I believe Josh Dix is going to exit. Two Tony, coming out. Yeah, Tony. Oh, Freeman and Perkins coming out. So Cricky's uh, the only mainstay out there. He and Price or Patrick McCaffrey back in the game. Dembele and Brock Harding. 
And no, oh, oh, Dix stays in the game. He's in the near corner here. So the Hawks go with two guards, three bigs, and Cricky double teamed and a nice entry pass by Dembele. Got it to uh, Big Ben. And he'll get two free throws. Oh, check that one and one. 8.25 to go. I think they'll take it out of bounds underneath. Okay, just the 16 six, foul yeah. on North uh, Florida. So it is uh, underneath out of bounds. Hawks will take it. Harding, oh, great pass. pass to a cutting Josh Dix for the layup. Rock, Harding, a no-look line drive. Right through the defender's arms. Uh, Deacon Hill throw there and hit Josh Dix in stride. Now here's a turnover. Just losing the dribble is Jalen Smith. McCaffrey all the way misses the left-handed lay attempt. And back running the other way is Smith. The rebound leaves it to Chaz Lanier. Block shot. Josh Dix blocks down on Lanier. Gets the rebound. Ahead to McCaffrey. Layup good. Oh, that was entertaining. That was entertaining. And this is the defensive unit out there. You got length and you got quickness. Josh Dix showing he's got some hops as he uh, blocks that one down. 84-66 Hawks. 7.43 to play in the game. Taking the dribble left wing is Coleman. Here's a corner three. Deadens off the iron and falls through. <laughs> Oscar Berry, big smile on his face. Yeah, they just keep throwing up threes. Rock Harding with a shot that was short off the rim in the lane. 84-69 with 7.21 to go. They're going to keep throwing up threes. Here's another one. Good again by Jalen Smith. Look out below. He's got 15. And it's a 12-point lead. Iowa led by 20 a moment ago. He's got... Four three-point field goals. Three of them made here in the second half. A dozen threes for the Ospreys. Iowa keeps pounding the ball inside. And Ben Cricky is fouled. And he'll get two when play resumes. Timeout on the floor. Hawkeyes 84, North Florida 72. Ospreys are fighting hard, but down 12. 7 one to go. This is Hawkeye basketball presented by Wellmark. Blue Cross Blue Shield from Lurfield. When the game goes into overtime. But... The game goes into overtime. The choice to enjoy is easy. Bud Light. Easy to drink. Easy to enjoy. Order Bud Light online today. Enjoy responsibly. Anheuser-Busch Bud Light Beer, St. Louis, Missouri. It takes hard work to be the best in the game. Planning, commitment, resilience, sweat. That's why Old Dominion Freight Line, the number one national LTL carrier for quality, works hard to be the best in the game and is proud to support those striving to be the best in theirs. Old Dominion Freight Line, official freight carrier of Iowa Athletics, helping the world keep promises. Have you heard about this new type of television experience from Epson? It's called the Epic Vision Ultra Laser Projection TV. It combines a new type of laser projection technology along with a unique Epson Silverflex screen to produce an epic 120-inch 4K Pro UHD picture that's up to four times bigger than a traditional 60-inch TV. There's no better way to watch live sports, and watching Iowa basketball play live on this big, bright TV is simply awesome. If you're a sports fanatic like me, you need to check this new Epson TV out for yourself. Visit Epson.com TV to learn more. On the home stretch here at Carver, Iowa 84, North Florida 72. 12 three point goals by North Florida. Florida's kept it interesting, but uh, the Hawkeyes are getting to the foul line now. They're wearing them out inside and uh, have uh, control of the boards right now 25 22. Multiple double figure scores for the Hawkeyes, four total, led by Perkins 19. 12 each for Patrick McCaffrey and Owen Freeman. And 10 for Ben Cricky. Iowa's leading board man, Peyton Sanford. He's got, he got seven. He's had a bunch in the second half. Seven, seven points, uh, seven rebounds for eight points. Had a free throw in there. Yeah. Eight, eight rebounds. Yeah, eight rebounds. That's what his average is there to lead the team. So the Hawkeyes with the lead at 
84-72. And Ben Cricky to shoot a pair. Cricky with 15 points. First one is good. He's double checking. He's a perfect seven for seven mm -hmm. from the free throw line. Lefty. Make it eight for eight. Been working on it. He has. One, two, two press. Almost forced another turnover. Harding poked the ball away, but it's grabbed back by Amitri Moss. Here's Moss with the ball. Crossover dribble. Throws his shoulder into Harding. Backs him down. Leans in. And misses the shot. Throws it up over the rim, and it's out of bounds. Touch last by Moss. That's just outstanding defense by the Iowa guard. Yeah, keeping your hands out there. Little guy, Brock Harding, chest to chest with the 55 over there. That is Amitri Moss. It didn't give any ground. Now the Hawks throw it away on the inbounds as uh, Lanier steals it. Hits a teammate on the wing for three, and no good. Strong rebound by Josh Dix off the miss by Trent Coleman. Hawks are running the other way. Harding. Shot fake. He'll bring it out now. Hawks got, got enough points. They need to run some clock here. 86-72. Here's McCaffrey with the scoop layup. Hard take. Drove into heavy, heavy traffic. And Patrick showing some strength there. Went up through two defenders. He did and just took the hit. Scored the basket. 16 now for Patrick. And at the other end, a counter score. Quick score by Amitri Moss. He that time used his backside to back down Brock Harding. Turned and Pumped it in from five feet away. 88-74, Iowa. All nickels, 5.55 to play in the game. Nice backdoor pass. Dix to Crippy. Crippy, and he lays it up and in. Purdy pass. High-low action. Josh Dix right on the money to Ben Crippy. He now has 19. Hawkeye lead is 90-74. to Shot goes down for Moss. He's looking to pad his stats. He's shooting every time he gets his hands on the ball. And he's been effective. He's got a dozen. Fouled on Iowa, so the and one coming from Moss. Then Belly comes out of the game, gets a handshake from Coach McCaffrey. Brock Harding likewise out. Perkins is back in for the Hawkeyes. Along with um, Owen Freeman. Freeman and Dix, McCaffrey and Cricky, and Tony Perkins. 5.25 to go. Free throw's good. The and one by Moss gives him 13 on the night. And a taller Josh Dix took Moss right to the rim and laid it up and in. That's what you're supposed to do. He got the size advantage in there. Went to the left hand. It just took the hit in the upper shoulder, upper body, and gets a basket. A couple baskets for Josh. He gets a poke away now on Moss. Moss gave up the basketball. Nice defense by Dix. He had a block shot and now a punch away. 16, uh, 15 turnovers on North Florida. Hawkeyes with just eight. Iowa with eight more points off turnovers. That's been a factor. Dix is double teamed. They're chasing the, the dribbler now. Gets it left wing to Cricky. Hand off to Perkins down the left side of the lane. Step back. Jumper is good. How did that go in? With a man draped all over him, actually knocked him down. Tony's in his zone right now. TP has got, let me count him, 21 points, Perkins. Good effort by Tony tonight. He muscled that shot up and right through that patented rainbow 15-footer. He's out here early working on it, too. 4.20 to go in the game. Here's another three missed from the wing by Trent Coleman. Hawks with a rebound and a run out. Cricky all the way. Missed the layup, but he's fouled with 4-11 to play in the game. Hawkeye basketball. Been brought to you tonight by Wimmers. Nothing goes better with Hawkeye sports than Wimmers meats. Wimmers hot dogs and sausages deliver the home game experience to your family and friends. Wimmers, the official hot dog of the Hawkeyes. Two free throws coming for Channel Ben. He's 9 for 9. Makes it 10 for 10 from the foul line. He's at 20 plus. Tony Perkins, 21. 95 77. Make it 96 77. Cricky's in a zone at that 15 foot stripe, isn't he? He is. He's going to get in the record book, too. When you make uh, over 10 in a row, he's got 11 in a row right now in a single game. That's 
Going to be about third or fourth in all time. Another 10 second violation is called on Moss. 15 turnovers. Actually, that'll be the 16th turnover, and I think they've had three or four 10 second violations. So the 1 2 2 working nicely tonight. Yeah. Patrick McCaffrey will inbound right in front of us. Got a big lineup here with Patrick and Owen Freeman, Cricky, Perkins, Dix. Lanier, length. Lanier comes out of the lineup. Oh, here's a steal on the inbounds. Dribble drive. Picked away. Run out and a shot blocked by Owen Freeman. Blocked it again. You get another one. Another putback. Blocks it a third time. Wow. Three blocks on two different guys. And at the other end, Cricky or Freeman. Freeman is fouled. He <laughs> wanted it up. He's laughing. He <laughs> Oh, man. The crowd that hasn't left is giving Owen Freeman a standing O. That's outstanding. <laughs> outstanding defense. Blocked the first. Offensive rebound. Blocked the second shot by a different Osprey. And then the, I believe, was the original ball handler. Got the ball back. Flipped it up there again. I know he blocked once on uh, Miles. And the second time on Dorian James. And it might have been James on the third time. Block to block to block How by Owen that? Freeman. <laughs> I don't know if I've ever seen that. No, I didn't, you know. I mean, in that back short span, like. That was quick. Three seconds. Talking the, about jumping jack. The rim protector there, buddy. Yeah, 6'10". Is he going to be fun to watch? Owen Freeman. We'll go to our final break of the night. 3.45 to go. The Hawkeyes have the lead at 96-77. And free throws coming for the big O when we come back. This is Hawkeye Basketball. Presented by Wellmark Blue Cross Blue Shield from Learfield. Hi, I'm Gary Dolphin, and if you want your home to be exceptionally comfortable during these cold Iowa winters and hot, humid summers, you need to turn to Dave Lennox and your local Lennox Home Comfort Specialist. Lennox has been serving Iowa consumers since 1895, when Dave Lennox built his first furnace in Marshalltown, and Lennox is still building its high-efficiency furnaces and air conditioners there today for the best home comfort system you can buy. It's Lennox and your local Lennox dealer. Lennox and the Hawkeyes. Now there's a winning combination. To anyone passing through our state, fields and fields of corn might be what they see. But the people who call Iowa home know it's so much more. Corn is ethanol, a homegrown, renewable fuel. Corn is delicious pork, beef, poultry, and dairy. Corn is in 4,000 products we rely on every day. So yeah, our highway views are full of corn, and we're proud of it. Because corn grows Iowa. Show your support for Iowa corn farmers at iowacorn.org backslash corngrowsiowa. This is John. Hey, my name is John Jackson. He's not some actor. He's a steward of the land with a John Deere 3 Series tractor and a PTO Quick Connect that hooks up rear implements with a single click. John runs with us because to him, there's nothing more important than connecting with the land. Nothing runs like a deer. Hear John's story at deer.com. Stop by your local John Deere dealer for a test drive today or learn more at deer.com. Your Iowa John Deere dealers, proud sponsors of Iowa basketball. Hawkeyes closing in on uh, win number five of the young season, leading 96-77. So we sorted that out. Oscar uh, Berry got the steal on that Hawkeye inbounds play a moment ago. Freeman chased him down the floor. <laughs> Like a dog running down a rabbit. <laughs> and blocked that first yeah, one, yeah. Oscar went up for the layup, and uh, Freeman pinned it. It was rebounded by Dorian James. He flipped it back up there. He swatted that one away right back to James. He put it up a third time, and Freeman uh, wiped it off the glass as well. Three straight blocks by the young freshman, Freeman. Now he gets fouled at the other end, makes both free throws. So he has a new career high, 16 points. And five block shots and three steals. <laughs> How about that line? Three in about three seconds. Five uh, rebounds. Turnover on uh, Jalen Smith. Player of the game. Stumbled with the dribble. Of course, they've had, I think, four 10-second half-court, uh, mid-court violations on him tonight. Smith turns it over for the 17th time by North Florida. And the Hawks have the ball right back. With three and a half to go in the game, leading 
Iowa shooting from the century mark. Here's Perkins to Price Sanford. Shot fake. Now to Dix. His three. Good. Oh, great play by Price Sanford. Shot fake. Drove it in. Backed it out. Found a wide open Dix for three. 101-77 Iowa. Got such a pretty shot. And then more unselfish play out of the Hawkeyes there. Making the extra pass. Passing up a good shot for a great shot. Three minutes, five seconds to play. Dembele going to come back in. Here's a three. No good. That is the uh, 29th three attempt by the Ospreys tonight. They've made 12. They get the offensive rebound. James inside. Now, is he going to challenge Freeman again? Oh, they get Freeman for a foul. His first. Just the fourth team foul on the Hawkeyes. Dembele comes in and replaces Patrick McCaffrey. Patrick will leave with 16 points. Good night for him. 7 of 13 shooting, 5 rebounds for PMAC in 30 minutes. Veterans played well tonight, and so did the youngsters. Here's the inbounds feed. A corner 3, no good. Freeman with another rebound. How about that outlet pass? Mm -hmm. He gets it before his feet hit the floor. The well ball coach on to a teammate. Moline High, stand up and take a bow. Freeman and Harding playing very well again tonight. They get better with every game, don't they, Bob? Yeah, they, they really do. And, and Franz trusted them out there on the court, getting some extra minutes here. But phenomenal performance tonight by Owen Freeman. Errant pass by Dembele trying to find Freeman. Hawks turn it over for the 10th time, about on their average, a little, little above their average. 101-77, Hawkeyes. Here's James with a catch high post right. Throws his shoulder into Freeman. Freeman knocks the ball away. Stolen away by Sanford. Owen Freeman. You would think James had enough by now. But he keeps going at the long-armed wonder from Moline. Hawks spread the floor. They've got enough points with a minute 54 to play. Gosh, with a stop-and-go move. Here's Sanford, left wing. Shot fake, drives a pass fake, I should say. Drives inside. Dembele with a shot fake from the corner. Now drives inside, misses a 14-footer. And it's rebounded by Jalen Smith of North Florida. Substitution timeout here for North Florida. Hey, don't settle for ordinary with your company's apparel. Say hello to a new standard of style known as Authentic Brand. Not just a label, it's a lifestyle. From sleek office essentials to laid back everyday wear, Authentic Brand is the label for you. It is for Bobby and I. These chilly nights, nice heavy pullovers that we're wearing here at uh, courtside at Carver Hawkeye Arena. Got a foul called on Iowa. We get back to action. Then Belly commits the personal. Two free throws coming for uh, North Florida. Got an email today. Authentic brand after the uh, of course it is the holiday. Authentic brand offering apparels and accessories apparel and accessories at up to 70% off. It's a great Iowa oh, company out of Perry. Yes, yeah, 70% off. Hats and caps and scarves and gloves. Go to authentic-brand.com. Authentic-brand.com. Owen Freeman comes out to a nice hand. And Big Evan Bronze gets his shot. 6'9", senior transfer from Belmont out of Iowa City West. Price Sanford for three. A little strong. Kicks long to DeSante Bowen. Iowa leads at 101-78 with one minute to go in the game. Dix. Sanford left wing. Drives hard left baseline. He's covered up. Covered up there by Max Herdlicka. Her 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 just into the game. Foul called on Brandon Rasmussen, a 6'4 junior. Sonny Bowen, who got knocked sideways, will go to the line for two. Throughout the Iowa Corn Cyhawk Series, Iowa Corn promotes values that are uniquely Iowan. On behalf of Iowa's corn farmers, we salute all athletes for their hard work and determination, both on and off the field. Just like our athletes, our state leads the nation in corn and ethanol production. Follow Iowa Corn on Facebook and learn how corn grows Iowa. Cy Hawk Series, big week next week. Hawkeye basketball will be at Hilton Coliseum on Thursday, but Purdue first on Monday night. Number one ranked Purdue Monday night from Mackey Arena. Here's Bowen. Sante Bowen, the two made free throws. 
He's only missed one free throw all year long. 103-78, Hawkeyes. They got it under control midway through this second half. Missed jump shot from the corner by Nate Litteris. And the Hawkeyes, I don't think they have, well, shot clock, game clock are about the same. Take the turnover. Take the turnover. 103-78 will be the final. The Hawkeyes. 13-1 run. Finish the game. Iowa will improve to 5-2. and two. Got, a, got a handshake line going. Uh, got in about uh, half a quick. second. And Here comes the naturally the, the flag man runs out on the floor. <laughs> Just inbound it. Well, I don't blame them. They see the handshake line going. And guys, uh, <laughs> we still have to inbound, make it legal. <laughs> Four tenths of a second. We might as well interview Matt Gatons. Yeah. <laughs> He's sitting Player of the game. Of Coach of the game, Matt Gatons. I don't know if you have this guy. Okay, now here comes the fight for Iowa flag. Back out on the floor. Well, there's much to celebrate. An impressive win by the Hawks. Good effort by North Florida in the first 25 minutes of the game. And then the Hawks with that depth. Owen Freeman with back-to-back-to-back -to -back -to -back blocks in the same sequence. You'll hear that on our post-game wrap-up. Great balance scoring by the Hawkeyes tonight, too. That that was critical, and the defense forced 18 North Florida turnovers. Five in double figures, or six in double figures with Owen Freeman with the 16 points, five rebounds, five block shots. 13 more points off turnovers. That says it all. The Hawks win it. By a count of 103.78. Hey, the football team is headed to a bowl, but there's business to be done in Indianapolis Saturday night for the Big Ten Championship with the Michigan Wolverines. Travel Leaders Destinations Unlimited would like to let you know when the Hawkeye Bowl bid is announced, and that'll be on Sunday. And they'll take care of you for game tickets, air travel, and hotel. Sign up to automatically receive official bowl travel information at HawkeyeSports.com slash Bowl Central. Iowa wins it by 25. The U.S. Cellular postgame show is coming up next. This is Hawkeye basketball from Learfield. You've been listening to healthy coverage of the Iowa Hawkeyes, presented by Wellmark Blue Cross and Blue Shield. Also brought to you by Linux and your local Linux home comfort specialist. Made right here in Iowa since 1895. Shelter Insurance. Find an agent for your auto, home, and life at shelterinsurance.com. Iowa Lottery. Be a VIP with the Iowa Lottery. Visit ialottery.com for details. Bud Light. Easy to drink, easy to enjoy. And buy. Riverside Casino and Golf Resort, home of the Draft Day Sports Lounge, just minutes south of Iowa City. This is Hawkeye Basketball from Learfield. At MidAmerican Energy, our 1.6 million customers depend on our energy 24-7. That's why we work 24-7 to deliver the safe, reliable energy you need. To keep our 99.9% .9 reliability record, we're enhancing our technology, improving resiliency, and investing in critical infrastructure. We're generating power from all available resources to cover any increases in demand. And we're innovating to ensure you always have the energy you need. MidAmerican Energy, obsessively, relentlessly at your service. Right now, new and current customers can get any phone for free at U.S. Cellular. So you can connect with all your family members this holiday season. Like your snowbird grandparents, your adorable nieces, or your favorite uncle. Just think, with any phone free from U.S. Cellular, you can even call your aunt who always makes you talk to your cousin, who's a dog. Or, you know, maybe just send her a festive text. Everyone can get the gift of connection at U.S. Cellular. Get any phone free today. U.S. Cellular. Built for us. Terms apply. Visit uscellular.com for details. Hurry up, dude. The game's about to start. Nothing beats spending the day watching the game with your buddies. Dude, I'm literally right here. Let's do this. Which is why a shelter insurance renter's policy is key to your winning game plan. It protects things your landlord's policy doesn't. Uh, dude, where's your TV? What? Oh, no way, dude. Like that flat screen TV that just got stolen. To draft an agent for your team, visit shelterinsurance.com. We're your shield. We're your shelter. There's a Honda for every holiday adventure. 
Whether it's traveling to the holiday family dinner in an efficient Accord hybrid, or heading to a hike to burn it off in a powerful CRV hybrid. Find your new Honda during Happy Honda Days. For a limited time, well qualified buyers can get a 3.9% APR on a 2024 Accord hybrid and a 2024 CRV hybrid. So see your central Midwest Honda dealer today. Honda gets the Midwest. See dealer for financing details. On the Hawkeye Sports Network, from Learfield, Hawkeye Basketball has been brought to you by Authentic Brand. It's more than just a label, it's a statement. University of Iowa Healthcare, changing medicine, changing lives. By your local Ford dealers. U.S. Bank, proud to support Iowa basketball. U.S. Bank, equal housing lender, member FDIC. And by... Iowa Lottery. Be a VIP with the Iowa Lottery. Visit IALottery.com for details. This is the U.S. Cellular Post Game Show. U.S. Cellular, built for the Hawkeyes. Built for silencing notifications and turning up the noise. U.S. Cellular, built for us. Now the Hawkeye veterans lead their teammates to victory tonight. Tony Perkins, 21. 21 for Ben Crickey. 16 for Patrick McCaffrey. Oh, and that youngster, Owen Freeman. How good was he? 16 points, five rebounds, five block shots, and three steals. Mm. And three of the five block shots came in about a 20-second sequence, Bobby, late in the game. That was fun. That was fun to watch. He chased the one guy down there on the first one and timed it up, blocked it off the glass, and then stayed with it. They tried to challenge him two more times. He <laughs> swatted it away. Just uh, That's going to open a lot of eyes around the Big Ten with that big fella. That'll make the highlight reel tonight. Might might make Sports Center tonight. The Hawkeyes led by just four at the half, and uh, after uh, uh, North Florida got an uh, uh, early second half lead, went up by one on a 6-0 run. The Hawkeyes got a three-point goal from Patrick McCaffrey, and then a three-point play by Tony Perkins, and that started a, a huge run. The Hawks never looked back. They outscored uh, UNF 56-35. Outscoring by 21 in the second half, and Win it going away, 103 to 78. We had no reviews tonight, no plays under review. Uh, had we, though, uh, Atletico was there to sponsor our video replay review. Atletico, physical therapy is the thing you're told to do after medication, x rays, or surgery. But what if the best way to fix your pain is to start where you normally finish? The sooner you start with physical therapy, you change everything. It all starts with no prescription needed at Athletico. Eddie Podolak has used Athletico physical therapy. And Ed never looked better. Keep him going. <laughs> it keeps, keeps those kneecaps and hips limbered up. Can't feel good. <laughs> Athletico. Proud supporter of Hawkeye basketball. 103-78 Iowa wins here tonight. And now it's uh, down to Mackey Arena Monday night, Bobby, uh, to take on number one Purdue. The, the uh, quirky schedule, uh, you know, you're trying to squeeze 20 Big Ten Conference games in. Uh, each team plays two in-league games in early December. Yeah, and The it, Hawks are home a week from Sunday to Michigan, but first... It's big Zach Eady and the Boilermakers. Yeah, when you got uh, you know 14 teams, you got to squeeze games in there when they can. I kind of like it because uh, you're ready for it. You want to see some serious competition. You get no- great opportunity. Number one team in the country on their court. Good time to play them, too. And the Hawkeyes have played uh, Purdue tough at Mackey Arena. Uh, haven't come away with a victory, but uh, whether it's the Murray Twins or Bohannon uh, and uh, last year with Chris and with Philip Rabracha, they've given Purdue good, solid competition, but uh, Purdue... Always uh, seems to find a way to win. That's why they're ranked number one. Let's do the Latham Seeds Charity Stripe recap from this game tonight. Iowa certainly controlled the free throw line. 23 of 26. Uh, The Hawkeyes from the foul line. 23 of 26. And let's check out that percentage. Well, I'm getting conflicting numbers here. I have, uh, here we go. Yeah, 23 of 26, 88.5%. That is lights out for the Hawks, uh, courtesy of Latham Seeds and the Charity Stripe Recap. For North Florida, they made 6 of 9. So the Hawks out free throw. North Florida 23 to 6, which more than makes up for those 12 three-point goals uh, that the Ospreys uh, uh, measured. Uh, The Hawks uh, ended up with 8 threes, so they closed the gap uh, toward the end of the game. Uh, North Florida with the... 
six made free throws in nine attempts. That measures out to f- to uh, 67 percent. That's our ch- Latham Latham Seeds Charity Stripe Recap. Brought to you by Latham High Tech Seeds. Just like the Hawkeyes' diverse talents, no seed company has more trait and genetic diversity than Latham High Tech Seeds. Thank you, Latham, for supporting Hawkeye basketball and the American Cancer Society through the Hawkeye Charity Stripe promotion all season long. This is Hawkeye basketball from Learfield. Equity salutes today's hero of the game as a proud sponsor of the ongoing recognition of our military during Hawkeye games this season. Please join American Equity in thanking all who have served our country. American Equity is more than just retirement savings and income products. They are committed to providing you best-in-class service and high-quality retirement income that helps deliver the independence to dream and reach your goals. To learn more about American Equity, please visit their website at American-Equity.com. Do you want to play an integral part in helping the Hawks win championships? Now is your chance to make a difference. Join the Swarm today and partner with Iowa football and the Iowa men's and women's basketball programs to serve charities in Eastern Iowa. Your tax-deductible Swarm donation will compensate our Iowa student-athletes for working to further the missions of local charities such as the United Way, Big Brothers and Big Sisters, and more. Go to iowaswarm.com for more information and make Iowa athletics the place for our student-athletes to experience the thrill of winning championships. Hawk fans, be sure to visit and connect with these local business partners of the Iowa Hawkeyes, located in the Des Moines area, Car Law, Community Choice Credit Union, and Royal Flooring. Facing a criminal charge or complicated family law situation, Car Law Firm has the trial experts you need. As experienced trial attorneys, we understand how much is on the line. Go to carlawiowa.com for a free consultation. That's car with two R's, lawiowa.com. Our mission at Open All is to provide exceptional retirement living and health services through life care. I'm Steve Rowe, CEO. We are a not-for-profit life plan community and have served the Iowa City area for 57 years. Oakdale is located near University of Iowa Hospitals and Clinics, Kinnick Stadium, Carver Hawkeye Arena, Hancher Auditorium, and downtown Iowa City. Visit our website at oakdale.com to learn more. We're a proud sponsor of Hawkeye Athletics. Go Hawks! Welcome back to the U.S. Cellular Post Game Show. U.S. Cellular is a proud sponsor of the Iowa Hawkeyes. U.S. Cellular wants you to make the most of today by choosing game day traditions first and scrolling later. U.S. Cellular built for us. Iowa wins at 103.78 over the Ospreys of North Florida. Let's pause 10 seconds for station identification. You're listening to Iowa Hawkeye Basketball. Thanks to our flagship stations, WHO AM 1040 in Des Moines and AM 600 in Cedar Rapids, WMT AM 600, and all of our stations along the Hawkeye radio network. Our best in the game will be Tony Perkins for Tony's effort tonight. Uh, He played 30 minutes, played heavy minutes, scored 21 points. Uh, He will join us here shortly. In the meantime, points in the paint, courtesy of Spahn and Rose, went Iowa's way and how. Hawks had 12 more paint scores, 46 to 34. Contractors, you're busier than ever, but you've got this with high-quality building materials from Spot and Rose, including GAF Roofing. Use the Spot and Rose Visualizer and plan the perfect roof and blend an architectural look with exceptional performance. GAF, we protect what matters the most. With several Spot and Rose locations, you can focus on life's other important things. Spawn and Rose, buy easier and build better. Little frog in the throat here. Uh, 46 paint scores to 34 for the Hawks. Nothing you can do. Just keep hacking until you get rid of it, right? 46-34, Iowa wins the battle of paint scores. In fact, we can uh, <clears throat> excuse me, start our stat recap. Courtesy of Hy-Vee until Tony Perkins uh, joins us. Bobby Hansen's off to the Hawkeye locker room to do his sit-down with Fran McCaffrey. We'll have that uh, straight ahead as as well. Tell you what, let's take another break. Uh, let me uh, grab a little water, and when we come back, we'll continue our U.S. Cellular postgame show. 
The Hawks beat North Florida 103-78. This is Hawkeye basketball from their field. How do you become America's best-selling brand? Let's break it down. Innovative tech means smarter and safer driving. Intelligent all-wheel drive will keep you ready for anything. And built Ford Tough Trucks will always get the job done. Plus, come into your local Ford store today and get super low APR financing, big cash back, and great lease offers on Ford's full line of cars, trucks, and SUVs. That's Ford, and that's how you become America's best-selling brand. Sales claim based on calendar year sales. The big game. Family. Friends. We know you count on Alliant Energy to deliver the safe, reliable energy you need. Whether you're watching the game, cooking your famous burgers, or leaving a light on for loved ones. For us, it means going beyond the expected to make sure we're planning for the energy you need today and tomorrow. That way you can keep your eye on the ball and focus on what's most important to you. Find out more at AlliantEnergy.com slash Powering Beyond. Hawk fans, stop in and visit the newly renovated guest rooms at Hyatt Regency Coralville Hotel and Conference Center located in the heart of Iowa River Landing. Stay within walking distance of Extreme Arena, home of the Iowa Hawkeye volleyball team, as well as great restaurants, shopping, and scenic walking trails along the Iowa River. Hyatt Regency Coralville is also the home of Hawk Talk with Lisa Bluter and Fran McCaffrey this fall. Come together at Hyatt Regency Coralville, where everything you need is right here. This is John. Hey, my name is John Jackson. He's not some actor. He's a steward of the land with a John Deere 3 Series tractor and a PTO Quick Connect that hooks up rear implements with a single click. John runs with us because to him, there's nothing more important than connecting with the land. Nothing runs like a deer. Hear John's story at deer.com. Stop by your local John Deere dealer for a test drive today or learn more at deer.com. Your Iowa John Deere dealers, proud sponsors of Iowa basketball. Welcome back to the U.S. Cellular Post Game Show. The Hawkeyes defeat the Ospreys of North Florida, 103-78. Time to meet our best in the game, sponsored by Old Dominion Freight Line. Old Dominion Freight Line works hard to be the best in their game, and they're proud to support those striving to be the best in theirs. We had many candidates tonight, but we thought Tony Perkins got it done at both ends of the floor. Uh, He played 30 minutes, played heavy minutes, scored 21 points. Uh, co-led Iowa with 21 points, 8 of 10 from the field, including a pair of three-point goals uh, and three of four from the foul line. When that when that rainbow jumper starts falling, uh, you get in that streak and you get in that, that, that blind roll there where no matter what you throw up, this one you threw up from right here and got knocked, knocked on the floor, and it uh, never touched uh, a bit of iron. It hardly touched the twine. Uh, uh, I don't know if I'd call you a streak shooter, but uh, tonight you were. Uh, yeah, um, you know, I had some motivation tonight, and I probably will for every game that I play now, even more motivation. But um, i just been talking to uh, my shooting coach, and he was just telling me what I need to fix, looking at film, looking at my shot, and then also the support of my teammates, um, support me even with, even if I'm having a bad game, and also the coaches. So I just flipped that to a better game today. A couple of rebounds, a couple of assists. Uh uh, it's hard to put this team away. I mean, they keep coming at you. They keep flipping up three-point goals. We made 12 tonight, but uh, you you balance that out, you, the Hawkeyes, with uh, 23 of 26 from the foul line, control the backboards, and got 13 more points off turnovers. I know that's important. Yeah, um, like we preached, um, foul teams, so just attack, keep attacking, throw the ball in the post. They didn't really have nobody to guard Owen or Ben, so we just kept attacking them down low. Up four at the half, they come out, put a little 6-0 run on you, got the lead, I think it was one or two, and then Patrick drills a three, you get the steal, or Iowa gets the steal, you come back, get an and one, and you pulled away from there. Uh, that was a key stretch in the in the ball game. Yeah, it was just energy at that point. You know, first half, we should have been up more. We didn't come out with as much energy on the second half neither. So um, we got in the huddle, and we just said we need to push it up more. We need to get this win. Only one game this week, and that's important with Purdue lurking out yeah. there Monday night, right? Yeah, so now we're just ready to go play Purdue at Purdue. Big Ten basketball. Yeah, it's finally started. For a, for a week, <laughs> yeah. for a week anyway. Uh, talk about the development of your game from, uh, you know, I remember the great game you had in the Big Ten tournament championship a couple of years ago, and you told me then this is just the start, and you gradually just built that game so solid at both ends of the floor. You should be proud. Yeah. I feel like now I, I got it going now. So yeah, well that's yeah. good. Uh, 
the the trip out to San Diego, I would think, would uh, do wonders for you guys. It's kind of like a mini NCAA mm-hmm. tournament run there. Yeah. Two games in two days, huh? Yeah, it was it was tough. That was our first one, but uh, we prepare for it now. So, so tomorrow you get some rest. Uh, what do you go back to work on tomorrow? You personally in your game? Uh, tomorrow probably come in in the morning before I go to class, shoot around for a little bit, and then work out with our um, one of our coaches um, in the afternoon, and then go home. Keep building on what you're doing, right? Yeah. How about that uh, shot blocking <laughs> flurry by, by Owen Freeman? Three <laughs> three in about three seconds. That, that was a thing of beauty to watch. Yeah, I didn't expect him to block the third one, but when I when I had the chance to get it, I, was, I should have threw him out when I came back down, but I thought I wanted to bounce pass and make him duggle somebody. So. <laughs> that, that was unique. I, I've never, I don't think I've ever seen that. The three in that short of a time span. But I think it speaks uh, the big picture. Those, those freshmen are really coming. Yeah, they? yeah they're really good. Just now they can be playing a lot of minutes as well. So, I mean, they're, they're prepared. Well, you got to be happy for uh, that sophomore class, even though it's only two. Yeah. Uh, Bowen and Dix, uh, they both played well again tonight. Yeah, they always play well. Um, they always play good, regardless if it's in practice or the game. So I'm happy for our younger group, too. Tony, thanks. Great game tonight. Oh, thank you, you sir. Buddy. Tony Perkins, our Old Dominion best in the game with uh, 8 of 10 shooting, uh, 21 points, including a pair of three-point goals, and played 30 minutes. Old Dominion Freight Line, sponsoring our best in the game. We'll come back with more postgame, courtesy of U.S. Cellular, in just a minute. Iowa defeats North Florida, 103-78. This is Hawkeye Basketball from Learfield. Everyone knows the BBB is the Better Business Bureau, but depending on what you need, it's the Better Plumber Bureau, the Better Auto Mechanic Bureau, the Better Accountant Bureau. That's because the BBB connects people with businesses they can trust. So think of the BBB as the better check that business out first so you don't get ripped off bureau. Be smart. Always look for the BBB seal because it's looking out for you. Find a better business anytime at BBB.org. Do you want to play an integral part in helping the Hawks win championships? Now is your chance to make a difference. Join the Swarm today and partner with Iowa football and the Iowa men's and women's basketball programs to serve charities in Eastern Iowa. Your tax-deductible Swarm donation will compensate our Iowa student-athletes for working to further the missions of local charities such as the United Way, Big Brothers and Big Sisters, and more. Go to iowaswarm.com for more information and make Iowa athletics the place for our student-athletes to experience the thrill of winning championships. American Equity salutes today's hero of the game. As a proud sponsor of the ongoing recognition of our military during Hawkeye games this season, please join American Equity in thanking all who have served our country. American Equity is more than just retirement savings and income products. They are committed to providing you best-in-class service and high-quality retirement income that helps deliver the independence to dream and reach your goals. To learn more about American Equity, please visit their website at American-Equity.com. Hawk fans, be sure to visit and connect with these local business partners of the Iowa Hawkeyes. Located in the Des Moines area, Car Law, Community Choice Credit Union, and Royal Florin. Are your car payments baking you crazy? Bring home the bacon when you move your car loan to Community Choice and get up to three months of no car payments. Your bacon call, it's ready to go home. Bring home the bacon at unbankyourbacon.com. Loan subject to credit approval and analysis. See Credit Union for details. 103.78 103.78 the Hawkeyes beat uh, North Florida here tonight at Carver Hawkeye Arena and move out to a five and two on the season up next Purdue at Mackey Arena more on that in just a minute Tony Perkins our Old Dominion best in the game uh, as Tony was leaving we learned that um, his grandmother passed away on Monday and she was in Tony's words his biggest uh, biggest supporter and you get a little teary-eyed, and uh, we, we certainly uh, send along our thoughts, our prayers, our sympathies to uh, to Tony Perkins and his family on the death of his grandmother Monday. All right, let's go back inside the Hawkeye locker room. Bobby Hansen is sitting down. He's ready to go with Hawkeye basketball coach Fran McCaffrey on Iowa's 25-point win here over North Florida. He's sponsored by great Iowa John Deere dealers, including Van Wall Equipment in Ankeny. Coach, entertaining basketball game. You come away with a uh, really good victory here, a solid uh, victory, and, and you took it over in the second half. Your thoughts on the overall game? I think it was a really good win. Uh, that team has a lot of weapons. They're very well coached. Uh, 
they're hard to defend because they're gonna, they shot 31 threes. But that's about their average. I mean, there's been times when they've shot 35 to 38 threes. Uh, you know, so obviously if they make, they made 12. But sometimes they'll, you know, make 15, 16. Now it's hard to win. Uh, so we were pretty good being up on ball screens, up on handoffs, because you're taking away the three. But the problem with that is they have drivers, too. Like, they're not a bunch of slow guys. The ball handling guys, you know, you talk about, well, both point guards, and then obviously Lanier, those guys go off the bounce. And they get all the way to the rim. And they keep the post open because all they do is screen in the middle of the floor. So uh, it really takes a collective effort, five as one defensively, to beat this team. You know, and, you know, their last game, they were off in the first half and they got down 30, came back, cut it to nine on the road against LSU. It's no accident the way they play. And coach, a lot of stars in this game here tonight. To start with Tony Perkins, gave you great leadership and got you off to a, a quick start. I can't tell you how proud I am of Tony. I mean, it's been a rough week for him. He lost his grandmother on Monday. Uh, she was his biggest fan, very close. He couldn't practice. Uh, he was too emotionally distraught. Practiced yesterday. Uh, said she was his biggest fan. She, he was going to play today. And boy, was he special in both halves. But in particular, at the beginning of the game, when we were, were struggling a little bit, we needed somebody to get going, and it was him. And coach, uh, off the bench, the second union once again provided some really good defense and some energy in there. And in particular, Owen Freeman, that, that sequence were blocking shots. He kept challenging him. I think he ends up with five block shots and five steals or three steals. The, the, the incredible thing about him is, you know, he just has a keen sense of how to play at his pace, what we want to do on offense, what we want to do on defense. If he does make a mistake, he plays through it. Uh, and it's scary to think about how good he's going to eventually be. I mean, figuring how good he is right now. Uh, so I just got to keep getting more and more playing time. Coach, talk about uh, your defense in particular, that one two, 2 By my count, you had four 10-second violations and probably could have had maybe four or five more. We were really close in the first half. So we, we pushed up a little bit uh, with it in the second half to buy an extra second or two. And, you know, they were rocking it back and forth. And if you trap that third screen, you got a shot to get a 10 every time, and we did that. Yeah. And, and Coach, talk about um, Ben Cricky, um, another solid performance out of Ben. Not, not a ton of scoring in the first half, but definitely in the second half. Well, that's what, that was what was impressive, Bobby. I mean, they were, they, were, they were really physical. It's a team that's physical in the post. They have a, they're a no-layup team, which means they're going to foul you. So you're going to get to the free throw line. But the physicality affected him a little bit in the first half, and in the second half, it did not. He was phenomenal. And, Coach, now as we move forward, going to the, the crazy part of the Big Ten schedule where you play one on the road, one at home, and a great opportunity as you travel to West Lafayette, number one Purdue. Talk about this game coming up. Well, obviously, things change. You know, you're playing the number one team in the country on the road. You've been there a million times. The atmosphere is, is uh, very intense. But, again, a great opportunity to play a really good team in a tough environment, learn and grow. Uh, and then, of course, we have Iowa State in between. You know, a lot of times you just play your two, your two league games. We, we have a road game with Iowa State in between, who's also, obviously also a very good team, also a tough road environment. So uh, I'm anxious to see how we perform, you know, in those two settings. And coach, I got to go back. I'm trying to see my notes down there below me. But to Ben Cricky from the free throw line, overall the team free throw shooting was outstanding, 23 out of 26. And Ben Cricky's going to get himself in the record book on 11 for 11 for tonight. Talk about that extra work that they put in. Well, he's a guy who's going to get fouled, so you, you you love the fact that he goes there and makes you pay for it. Same thing with Owen Freeman tonight. He was tremendous. So uh, when you throw the ball to your big guys, and you're playing a team that's going to foul step up there and make them pay, then we can also get into our press. Well, Coach, again, congratulations on this uh, victory here tonight, and uh, we'll see you on the road in Purdue. Appreciate it, Bobby. Thanks, Coach McCaffrey and Bobby Hanson. Brought to you by your Iowa John Deere dealer, including Van Wall Equipment in Ankeny. Nothing runs like a deer, especially when supported by the team at Van Wall Equipment. Stop by one of their locations and learn how to farm better, work smarter, and play harder when you run with Van Wall and John Deere.
Spotted Rose points in the paint go the Hawkeyes' way, 46-34 over North Florida. And we'll come back and uh, review all the stats next on the hy Stat Recap as Iowa beats North Florida 103-78. to uh, 78. That's the final. North Florida drops to 4-4. Four and four. The Hawks improve to 5-2. and two. This is the U.S. Cellular Postgame Show, and this is Hawkeye Basketball from Learfield. There's a Honda for every holiday adventure. Whether it's taking in the lights with all your friends in a spacious Accord or taking in a snow day in a rugged CRV. Find your new Honda during Happy Honda Days. For a limited time, well-qualified buyers can get a 3.9% APR on a 2024 Honda Accord and 2024 CRV. So see your central Midwest Honda dealer today. Honda gets the Midwest. See dealer for financing details. If you've got the right tools and the friendly people at U.S. Bank in your corner, making smarter money choices is a piece of cake. If only our tools and helpful advisors could have helped you avoid some of those not-so-smart choices in life. Like that time you tried to pick up unicycling. Oh, coming through! Or when you thought it'd be okay to pet that squirrel in the park. Good squirrel. Good squirrel. (laughs) While we can't help you with all that, we can help you bank smartly at usbank.com slash smarter together. Member FDIC. Hawk fans, be sure to visit and connect with the official local business partners of the Iowa Hawkeyes. The hotel at Kirkwood Center, Iowa's premier luxury hotel. The Jill Armstrong team with Skogman Realty, the area's premier realtor. And Melrose Meadows, voted Iowa City's best retirement community. The hotel at Kirkwood Center, a AAA four-diamond luxury property located just a few minutes from the Eastern Iowa Airport in downtown Cedar Rapids. Whether you're visiting for business or pleasure, the hotel is happy to welcome you. To make reservations, visit the hotel at Kirkwood.com. If you or someone you know is having thoughts of suicide, experiencing a mental health or substance use crisis, or just need someone to listen, 988 provides a direct connection to free, confidential, and compassionate support. When you call, text, or chat 988, you'll be quickly connected to trained crisis counselors who will listen to your concerns, provide support, and connect you to additional resources if needed. There is hope. You are not alone. For 24-7 support, call or text 988 or chat 988lifeline.org. Hawkeye basketball postgame coverage brought to you by U.S. Cellular. Time now for the High V stat recap as Iowa defeats North Florida 103 78. Not much to find fault with other than that first half. The Hawkeyes uh, uh, were uh, stumbling defensively a little bit and uh, it had a lot to do with three point shooting by North Florida. Uh, North Florida in that first half. Hit a half a dozen threes. In fact, eight for the fa- uh, for the half. Hawks got them covered up in the second period, uh, and they uh, connected on uh, just four more uh, from distance. Twelve of thirty-one for the game for North Florida. Iowa uh, very uh, judicious at their end. Eight of fourteen. The big stat: Iowa got to the foul line twenty-six times, making twenty-three, and uh, limited North Florida to six of nine from the free throw line. That was a huge stat. Plus, the Hawks got 13 more points off turnovers. For the game, Iowa shoots 36 of 61. That's a blistering 59%. 57% from three, 8 of 14, and 88% from the foul line, 23 of 26. For North Florida, they shoot 30 of 66, a respectable 45%, 12 of 31 from distance, and 6 of 9 from the free throw line. For Iowa, Five and double figures led by Tony Perkins, our Old Dominion best in the game. He had 21, as did Ben Cricky. Ben Cricky with 21 made made 11 straight free throws. 11 of 11 hit five of nine shots from the field. For that, Ben is our hot Hawkeye for the night, courtesy of your Lennox dealers of Iowa, including in Cedar Rapids Affordable Heating, Vicks Heating, Plumbing, and Vent in Decorah, Charks Plumbing, Heating, and Air Conditioning in Iowa Falls. Mechanical Air Systems Company has the Mason City area covered. And down south in Oskaloosa, stop in and see Van Often Plumbing and Heating. Cricky played 30 minutes, 21 points, 5 of 9 from the field, 11 consec- consecutive from the foul line. Uh, added a couple rebounds and a steal for good measure. Lennox, looking to heat up your home. Keep you nice and toasty warm uh, this winter. Thank you, Lennox Dealers, a longtime supporter of Hawkeye basketball. So 21 for Cricky, 16 for Patrick McCaffrey. He hit 7 of 13 shots, grabbed 5 rebounds. Peyton Sanford was Iowa's top board man with 8 
to go with his 10 points. Owen Freeman, the freshman, won a night, as you'll hear shortly, 16 points on 6 of 8 shooting and made all 4 of his free throws. Other scores for the Hawks, DeSante Bowen had 9 points, 3 assists, no turnovers. Uh, Josh Dix with a solid game, 7 points, 4 assists, and only 1 turnover. The Hawks turned it over just 11 times, turned over North Florida 18 times. There were 9 lead changes, just 1 tie in the game. Now for North Florida, their leading scorer on the night, 16 points for uh, Chaz uh, Lanier, 7 of 9 shots. Most of the damage by Lanier was done in the first half. 15 points for Jalen Smith. He reined in four threes, three of those in the second half. 13 points for Amitri Moss. And uh, that was it for double-figure scores for North Florida. Iowa out-rebounded the Ospreys handily, 36-29, to including seven offensive, nine offensive boards for uh, North Florida. Iowa did 47-43 at the half. And uh, about midway through that second period, went on a big run, outscoring uh, North Florida 56-35 in the second half to win it, going away 103-78. to Bench points goes uh, go to North Florida by eight. Uh, the Hawkeyes had more second-chance points, 13 more fast-break points, uh, 12 more paint scores, and 13 more points off turnovers. So the stat sheet pretty well dominated by the Hawkeyes, and they win it 103-78. to our postgame stat recap is courtesy of Hy-Vee. Score big savings with the all-new, totally free Hy-Vee Perks membership. Let's relive some of the moments early on. Patrick McCaffrey showed he, why he was going to have a good night. 5 nothing visitors. Asante Bowen gets three back with a corner jump shot. That's a nice drive and kick for the Hawkeyes. Penetration. Asante wide open in the near corner. And a moment later, uh, Tony Perkins on the assist to Patrick McCaffrey. Gets the ball back from Bowen. Isanti posting up inside. Goes to the corner. Tony for three. It's good. Back-to-back threes by Iowa. And there goes that 5 nothing North Florida lead. Now Bowen hits a three to start the game, and then Perkins a three-point play or a three-point shot off the assist from Desante Bowen, who was active early, and the Hawks had wiped out that early five-nothing lead with a six-zero run of their own. Midway through the first half, Tony Perkins uh, on the assist from Peyton Peyton Sanford before before Peyton had to go to the bench with two fouls. Uh, uh, he and Perkins hook up for an Iowa six-point lead. Here's NZ, a crossover dribble, gets down the left side of the lane, misses the jump shot. It's tipped to Dix. The Hawks are running the other way. Perkins, a deep three in transition. Good! Way on the left wing. Timeout, Matt Driscoll. 22-16 Iowa at that point. Uh, In the latter stages of the first half, Iowa's defense started to turn over North Florida. Harding races into the front court. Here's Perkins. Tony had the hot hand early for the Hawkeyes. Harding peering inside, gets it to Owen Freeman. Jump hook, good. And the Moline teammates hook it up. Yeah, that's after uh, North Florida had uh, scampered back to tie the game at 28. Actually took a lead of 28-26. Cricky hit two free throws. And then after a Freeman steal, Freeman hit the jump hook on the assist from Brock Hardy. And it was 30-28 Iowa. A moment later, Freeman was back at work. Patrick drives inside to Harding in the near corner. Brock weaves his way through heavy traffic. And what a great pass to Owen Freeman. And he lays it up and in. Harding did all the heavy lifting there. Freeman with the dessert. Yeah, 6-0 run there by the Hawks. Freeman's dunk put the Hawks up 32-28. They led by four. They would lead by four at the half, 47-43. Now in the second half, uh, a 6-2 uh, run. Uh, by uh, the Ospreys, put them up one at 51-50. Later it was uh, 52-51 in favor of the visitors, and Patrick McCaffrey went to work. Ben Cricky off right in his face, but McCaffrey for three, yes. Uh, uh, James was admiring the jump shot he hit at the other end and forgot where his man is, and Patrick strokes a three, 54-52 Iowa. The assist to Tony Perkins. Hawks get a stop, and then Perkins uh, puts the Hawks uh, up uh, six with an and one. Hawks are running the other way. Tony Perkins inside. Hits the shot and a foul call. The and one coming for a percolating Perkins right now. 
our old Dominion Freight Line uh, best in the game, Tony Perkins, uh, made the free throw. Actually, Iowa went up by five, not six. 57-52, that was a 6-0 run by the Hawks. They had a number of 6-0 runs, and they would put another one together, uh, led by Ben Cricky. McCaffrey, hard penetration in the lane, shot up no good. Put back attempt, no good. Rebounded by Cricky, up and good. That's a way to work over that offensive glass. Cricky with a putback put the Hawks up 61-54 with 13.55 to play. Iowa gets a stop, and uh, this would be part of a 12-2 run as Peyton Sanford was trying to make up for lost time spent on the bench with foul issues in the first half. Another weak side board by Peyton Sanford. He's picking up some numbers now. Peyton all the way himself. Drops into the lane. Shot up and good with a left hand, no less. 63-54 Iowa after the Peyton, ba- uh, Peyton Sanford basket. Uh, uh, Bowen, uh, Desade added two free throws a moment later after a three-point goal by uh, North Florida. And the Hawks are back up 8-65 to 57. And then it became a double-digit advantage off another North Florida turnover. And rebounded by Nate Litteris of North Florida. They're running. Bad pass in traffic by NZ. Picked off by Peyton Sanford. His three. Yes, sir. Knocks it down. Peyton Sanford. Uh, That put Iowa up double digits at 68-57. That came with just under 12 minutes to play in the game, and the Hawks uh, would take off from there. Uh, They had the lead uh, as much as... uh, uh, let's see, double check here, 25, 27 points uh, uh, for uh, most of the final 10 minutes. A lot of it had to do with defense. Now listen to this sequence with 3.45 to go in the game. Uh, North Florida kept going at Owen Freeman uh, on the same possession, not once, not twice, but three times uh, Owen with the rejection. Oh, here's a steal on the inbounds. Dribble, drive, picked away, run out, and a shot blocked by Owen Freeman. Blocked it again. You get another one. Another putback. Blocks it a third time. Wow. Three blocks on two different guys. <laughs> that was so much fun to watch. Uh, uh, the first one was uh, Oscar Berry. I uh, got a steal and a run out. And, and man, here's a kid, 6'10", flying down the floor uh, to uh, try and get involved in the play and reject the shot so he blocks Oscar and then Dorian James with the rebound 6-6 he's got good size put it right back up he swatted it away again while he was uh, on his tiptoes right back at James he threw it up a third time and see you later it was going the other way the Hawkeyes got the rebound and the run out they went it going away 103 to 78 those are some of the highlights from tonight's Hawkeye victory uh, over our neighbors from North Florida Back with more post-game courtesy of U.S. Cellular in just a minute. This is Hawkeye Basketball from Learfield. The big game. Family. Friends. We know you count on Alliant Energy to deliver the safe, reliable energy you need. Whether you're watching the game, cooking your famous burgers, or leaving a light on for loved ones. For us, it means going beyond the expected to make sure we're planning for the energy you need today and tomorrow. That way you can keep your eye on the ball and focus on what's most important to you. Find out more at AlliantEnergy.com slash Powering Beyond. To anyone passing through our state, fields and fields of corn might be what they see. But the people who call Iowa home know it's so much more. Corn is ethanol, a homegrown, renewable fuel. Corn is delicious pork, beef, poultry, and dairy. Corn is in 4,000 products we rely on every day. So yeah, Our highway views are full of corn, and we're proud of it. Because corn grows Iowa. Show your support for Iowa corn farmers at iowacorn.org backslash fan of corn. Right now, new and current customers can get any phone for free at U.S. Cellular. So you can connect with all your family members this holiday season. Like your snowbird grandparents, your adorable nieces, or your favorite uncle. Just think, with any phone free from U.S. Cellular, you can even call your aunt who always makes you talk to your cousin, who's a dog. Or, you know, maybe just send her a festive text. Everyone can get the gift of connection at U.S. Cellular. Get any phone free today. U.S. Cellular, built for us. Terms apply. Visit uscellular.com for details. Today is the day. After countless hours of research, cutting back expenses, and nine months of anxiously waiting for her, today is the day you finally bring home your new car. It's also the day to protect her with an auto policy from Shelter Insurance. 
Our policies are competitively priced and include new car replacement coverage if anything were to happen to your new baby. To find an agent near you, visit shelterinsurance.com. We're your shield. We're your shelter. Before we say goodnight, let's uh, take a look at the Drake or the U.S. Bank scoreboard. Courtesy of U.S. Bank, Drake was a winner over Valparaiso, 83-65 in college basketball. Northern Iowa, not so fortunate. Belmont knocked off UNI 90-70 at the, uh, the McLeod Center tonight. Ohio State in the Big Ten uh, defeated Central Michigan 88-61. And as far as ranked teams, games still going on, uh, Arkansas has a 75-68 lead on 7th-ranked Duke with one minute to go uh, down in uh, Fayetteville. So it looks like uh, uh, the Hogs are going to knock off the Dukies, uh, leading 75-68 with exactly one minute to play in that game. These are all finals among ranked teams. Colorado State, a winner over Colorado, 88-83. Uh, Virginia uh, bumped off 14th-ranked Texas A&M, 59-47. North Carolina ranked 17th, surprised number 10 Tennessee, 100 to 92. 22nd ranked James Madison outlasted Buffalo, 81-68. And it was 18th ranked Villanova going down to a crosstown rival St. Joe's, 78-65. Right here was the Hawkeyes placing five and double figures, led by uh, Ben Crickey's 21, Tony Perkins 21, as the Hawks defeat North Florida, 103 to 78. And now it's on to uh, Purdue uh, Monday night. That's an early tip, uh, 6 o'clock uh, Iowa time, meaning uh, 5 o'clock for the pregame show here on the Hawkeye Radio Network. And let's hope we're talking about uh, uh, an upset uh, championship run by the Iowa football team uh, a few miles down the road in Indianapolis as they take on Michigan. Now that is a 7 o'clock kick Iowa time. We'll be on the air at 5 o'clock with our uh, better-than-ever pregame coverage, two hours of Pre-game coverage from Indy and the Big Ten Championship. Good luck to Kirk and Iowa football. That's our coverage tonight of Iowa basketball. 103-78 the final. The Hawks defeat North Florida to get to 5-2 and two on the young season. My thanks to Bobby Hanson. I'm Gary Dolphin. Our engineer producer has been Corey Sheets. And this is Hawkeye basketball from Learfield. You've been listening to the U.S. Cellular Post Game Show. U.S. Cellular, built for the Hawkeyes. Built for silencing notifications and turning up the noise. U.S. Cellular, built for us. Hawkeye basketball has been brought to you by Authentic Brand, unique Hawkeye apparel at Authentic-Brand.com. Linux and your local Linux home comfort specialist. Made right here in Iowa since 1895. Mid-American Energy. Look up, look out for overhead power lines. Visit midamericanenergy.com for electrical safety tips. Also brought to you by Hy-V. Score big savings with the new Hy-V Perks membership. And by United Healthcare, committed to helping people live healthier lives. The preceding has been a Learfield presentation on the Hawkeye Sports Network.